Alright, hello guys, Tati here. <laughs> hello guys, Tati here, and welcome back for more of the Legend of Heroes Trails from Zero. A title from a saga. I mean, the, so the Crossbow Saga. And is one of my number one top favorite game series. Hello, friends, group pages, all that good stuff. How are you doing? Hope you're having a good morning, afternoon, good night. All that. You know. <laughs> now, you guys do me a favor. Sit back. Relax. Get your favorite snacks, breakfast, lunch, dinner, or dessert, whatever time zone you're in. And a nice cold drink or warm. And let's begin. But before we begin, what we did last time, well, we're just doing questing, talking, and then we try to move on with the next part of the story. We're finally inside the mansion. What well, kind of mansion? I mean, not the mansion. In the moon temple. But the play was so creepy that it cut off my stream. <laughs> oh, we doesn't do it again. I don't know what it was. I feel like it was my computer probably just, um, I keep having to sleep mode during the week. And I guess there was too much sleep mode that the computer's like, ah, oh, fuck, I'm just gonna shut it up. I'm just gonna cut it off. <laughs> so, yeah. By the way, this is part 27. Oh my god. This, this is the first time a, a game like this. Like, the first part of the. of a Trolls game has passed. I was about to be passed more than 30 parts soon. I, cause I, I mean, somebody already told me that I'm gonna beat this game probably in the right the last week of this month. So, yeah, here we go. So we skip some cutscenes. Why? Because we're already seeing all this stuff. So, hurry up, speed it up. There. So what we're gonna do is probably just not swing up. Yeah. Miss. By the way, for those that want to watch my stream and they want me to read their comments, it's kind of lame, but you have to come to my um. I mean, not lame, but. Don't want to make, make it sound like a chore to y'all, but you have to come to the page itself. So I can read our comments. For some reason, Facebook's not letting me see the comments from the group or page. So you have to come directly, directly to the gaming page. So yeah. Maybe always like, why always ignore my comments? I mean, I'm gonna put that now on the description so that way people can know, like, oh, you won't see, you will see my comments from the group. I have to click the video itself. I mean, from the group post. I have to go to the video itself and take me through it. But yeah, hello Alex, Adriana, Sparhawk, and Danny, welcome to the stream. And what do you mean wow, what's, 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 what's wow right now, oh, Danny? Let's see. So Steel's not gonna, let me still scan these guys, because I'm not gonna scan them again. Alright. Analyze. Where the information, just skull head. Items, S tablet, EP charge, information, a will of a will of the wisp will always explode when defeated. Oh yeah, spooky things. Yes. Gonna, we're gonna die with them. I mean, we're not gonna die with them, but they're gonna hurt me when I kill them. There, one's dead. Watch out, Lloyd! Boom. Oh, it's turn base? Yeah. Yes. It's a really fun game. The series is turn based for like the third saga board game. And the new game after that is gonna, it's gonna be um. And then the fifth saga, I mean, the, the, the fourth saga, I think that's where it stopped being turn base. Because people don't, people just don't like turn base. Hey Danny, what's up? 
I'm good. Adriana, how are you? Hmm. Oh, God. We went the other way. Okay, so the street cut off around here somewhere. Wait. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. There's enemies here now. I have not paid for it. Here we go. Yes. <laughs> there it goes. Team Rush. We got the ambush. We did the ambush. Now we use Team Rush. Go. Well, we got death, but I don't think we're death in this battle. What about that already? You're your man. Ready to learn Deadly Storm. It's probably just a regular S craft attack, not an S break. Ah! Leave me alone. This is rude. We're fighting inside the cathedral. Guys, show some respect for Adriel's sake. Up! <laughs> like, no, I don't want to get caught. I want to get ambushed. Someone will do this. Go. Say yes, sir. Go. Do damage, do damage. I think that's because they're dead. Yep, two down. And boy's gonna get hit again. Oh no, nobody got hit. Sweet. No one got hit! Yeah! Explode you on yourself, dumbasses. <sighs> you skullhead. Oh my god, I think he's still following us. Are you done battling? Alright, I'm coming after you. Yep. Hold on, I'm trying to figure out how to how can I catch this guy. Oh my god, I can see him from the other side. Yeah. Chos Chosen Sky um had that. I mean had enemies like that. I don't know about Cold Steel. I remember Cold Steel having explosive enemies. So, I think it's weird. Stop! I wanna kill you, hold on. Gotcha! Ambush success. Go. Boom, boom. Bang. Uh oh. Yes. He did. I mean, I remember they blow up, but oh god! Floyd died. The asshole. The asshole blew himself on Lloyd, Lloyd died! I think he had... What? Fuck. Ah! Uh... GG. Maybe he did. My dude died. I oh, don't care anything. Don't care anything. Oh god. Revive him! I think it will. Oh, it did it? But it killed itself. How? Oh God. Go, Randy. Boom. Miss, asshole. Damn. Go. Well, Loa, here's the bright side. You died for the waifus. I died to protect my waifus. Because I'm a man of culture, bitch. Let's see. Uh, where we go? Over here? Okay. Over here? Oh, this. Is that over there? Nothing. 
Oh, it's just a button. It's a button. He'll come to that in a bit. So let's go over here. But a lot of people who enjoy turn base look at them some of their favorite. Oh yeah, a Pokemon. The Pokemon has turn base too. Persona and Bravely. It's just the Final Fantasy community and like and the Legend Heroes, they believe that um that nobody likes turn base, so and they think that they'll make more money without turn base. So, eh. I hope this one game if they got ah, fuck! I got stuck. <laughs> we got death though. Oh, that thing has guard. Oh, it's a guard turn. She has death though. Die. Oh, missed. Well, your death didn't work. Why are you missing so much? Oh. Yeah, I prefer turn base. And if if action base, it depends on the game. Like some action base games are, they're okay as long as it's challenging, not smash buttons like an idiot, like, I mean, like, like making it so easy. There's games just take it too far. They did the worst action base game. Worst action based game. I might get shoot. I might get shot for me. I might get attacked for this, but. Oh my god, leave him alone! Fuck! Oh, it's guard. So that means he's gonna guard somebody. There's no point of that. Yep. That was the worst action base ever. All I gotta do is hold one button and he's already running around and attacking. Any direction. Hold that circle button. You don't need to move the analog stick. Just hold that circle button and he's already going everywhere like crazy. That's all you need is circle, 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 circle. And, or hold circle, Fallon, Korea Bomb. You look, but... The, but there are no small children in this trunk. Don't question it. That was, that's what that was what Eric said. Ah! Oh, fuck! Yes, the story. I hate the story. It was so lazy written. And the DLC, like they said, like all these DLCs to understand more. No, it just explains small certain things, man. Like this is a comparison. You know Xenoblade? You know Xenoblade has this DLC story, right? You know what the DLC story is going to be about? Y'all have an idea what the DLC story is going to be about. We've seen it through the story, and the game is already called um, Torna, the Golden Country. So, it's going to be about 500 years ago. So the game's gonna tell us about what happened 500 years ago, but guess what? The main game itself tells us already, like the idea, like the summary about Adam was a hero back in the day with, as the Aegis driver of, with Mithra, and hangs and traveling with Laura, Jin, ah fuck, Jin, and others, and I guess Bridget as well, as you see Bridget right there that one scene in the past. You know what I'm saying? But Torna, the Golden Country just gives you more details through that past. But we have an idea already. It's about the past between Mithra and Malos with Adam and the, and the gang. The game talks about it, but we don't know the details. The DLC story for that gives us the details and gives us the same thing that, happened, that we were told before. Gotcha, little asshole. Sensei Kano. I'm gonna say this. Gameplay? It tried to be like Kingdom Hearts. And I think Kingdom Hearts did a better job with, with, the, with the action base than this game. And that's this game, I mean. With Final Fantasy Like. Final Fantasy tried to be the mature game against Kingdom Hearts with this 
but in my opinion, gameplay wise, oh my god, Final Fantasy 15 for a Ready Team game is so ch is more childish than Kingdom Hearts gameplay. Kingdom Hearts, it's not hard to get into and stuff. Like, it's not that bad. I mean, it's a, it's a, it fits well for the gameplay of it. But Final Fantasy 15, oh god, man. Kingdom Hearts it plays way more mature. I mean, it plays more mature than 15. Oh, don't kill that armor guy. I have to scan it. No. Scan it, scan it, scan it, scan it, scan it. Analyze. Dulahan. Items, your material, reviving bomb. Information. A suit of armor that lost its head. Its lance can take the life of its prey. You won't see how it's placed unless I show myself. So I can show you. Look, guys, look at me. I'm holding. I'm holding circle. Look what I'm doing. <laughs> look at the gameplay right now. I'm holding this button. Look at the gameplay. Probably will do that soon. Unless found unless you're bomb. My parents warned me that bad chests go to Gehenna where they can never speak. <laughs> What's going on, Eric? Are we going further? I love this music right now. I guess not. Hold on. Is there anything else here? Nothing? No, there's nothing. It's just a one room with no other directions. Oh, yeah. Now I'll do it. I don't mind doing a little uh, sh short session stream of joining the game. Shoot. Believe it or not, I tried to stream the game for, for you guys to see how it's like. To see, so we can all suffer together, but it was just too much for me to stream it. I was like, you know, I'd rather, do it off, I'd rather just play off stream. I can't take it. We're not getting anything. People are getting bored. Watching me play this, so I'm not this game. I'm talking 15, so I'm gonna do it off. Yep. I'm just saying for some people they didn't know this, this information. Yep. If you if if you, you can ask Arcelli how boring it was. She was watching when she used to watch my stream. Let's tell me this way. What the fuck, man? Ah, fuck! Ambushed. I think it's one enemy. Ow. I don't think anybody, only like... And forbid for career criticizing any Final Fantasy game. If the game I played, the only game I played right now for Final Fantasy. Like, the last game I played of Final Fantasy series was Final Fantasy X. I don't know about 12, but I heard 12 is really good. Yeah, it's not turn-based, but... 
game, the gameplay is okay. It's like MMO. So I gotta try it out. Is it similar, almost similar to Xenoblade? Go. Bro, why are we dying? Go. Kill this armor guy, I don't trust it. Boom, I like how she runs. Uh -oh. I'll check it out. I have it on Switch. I don't know if you guys want me to stream old Final Fantasy games. I have them on Switch. But I don't know if you guys want me to watch, uh, watch that. Old school PS1 lookalike games. Original, I have not. I'm going to, to prove it, because people told me that the remake is not like the original at all. Like, story. Oh, God! Bring back Lloyd! No, bring back Lloyd! There he goes. Oh, God, recover Lloyd now, recover Lloyd now, recover Lloyd now. Hold on. Arts. Go. Heal. There it goes. What has no EP? At all, story wise. I mean, the beginning, they try to trick you, but this is around the story halfway point. It starts to become not like the, like, like the original. So, new players will now understand what the fuck this game is talking about. Because, like, we gotta try, because the whole game is about, like, we gotta, change, we gotta try to change destiny, so, like, shit like that. Like, destiny? What do you mean, destiny? New players, like, wait, so you're telling me something happened, something really bad happened? In the in the old game, then now you guys couldn't change it. Like why? This is a, a switch. This there is a switch here. Operate it. Yes. Why wouldn't you? Okay, it's a shortcut. Sweet. What's that? Oh. Oh. Go more over here now. Are these like? Are those like, um, coffins? Are they coffins? Hey, it's those guys again! Is that from, is that from Sky 3rd? Look at that guy. Stop wobbling, 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 wobbling. Stop wobbling, 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 wobbling. Don't kill it. You gotta scan it. Analyze. No, it's not. Poetry, guys. Items, softening, ointment, tira ball. Information. An evil spirit that causes trouble and petrified. Can split itself, hard to hit. Yes. Yes. No! Oh, there it is. Oh, it died. Stop the ointment. Okay. Something smells good, brother. Oh, those are... Wait, do we have those? Those are bow ones now. I have it on Switch, physical, with, along with 508. Archer, new material, smoke grenade. Information: a skeleton archer that wanders the underworld in search of a body. Attacks from afar. Yeah. Oh, you're about to get your ass kicked, sir. Go. Damn, 
Lauren do it. I mean, Lauren pretty easy, easy, so whatever. Mm -hmm. Oh, what the hell? Alright. Monster of fear. Monster of fear. Oh my god. Shoot him! Encourage. Strength up level one. Zai, I need you. Go. Oh no! We have to go through some hits. Oh, we got delayed. You want to glance? Miss. All right, go Zayt. Oh, they got don't de get delayed, you asshole! Why? Go. That was a bad idea. Go. Two down. Good job. Wait. That same attack as Josh was. The eye, evil eye. Found iron shoes. This chest is as empty as your soul. Chest kind ill needs a looter such as you. <laughs> what? Gotcha. Oh, here we go. Team Rush. Go. Boom, 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 boom. One, two. Bam. And churches. Found Celestial Bomb. You feel a sharp gaze stare at you from inside the void. Whose eyes are those eyes? What? Okay, so there's nothing then. Alright, so we went to the, we went the right way. Okay. <coughs> oh god, sorry. Leave me alone! Oh wait, we can go through here again. Nope, never mind. Let's see. Air's watching you. Thank you. I think we go, I guess we go this way. We have not gotten here yet. Was that is that a fairy? Yes. No, what the fuck are those? Not fairies. I think we're gonna kill them. So let's use Lord Scandum. Battle scope. And it lies complete. Wind fairy. It is a fairy. Item savory pinion. Mint drop. Information. A wind spirit that loves pranks. Spreads sleep inducing dust. Go. Your brother gonna die fast. Go. Bye bye. Boom, 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 boom. All right. Oh, 
Oh god, it's those things! Ah, oh, it burns! It's those weird things that we saw in Gehenna that some kid and some dude became one of them. Why are we fighting Gehenna enemies? That's scary! Kevin, we need you! Dead man. Items, antidote. Deluxe dumplings. Information. Ghost rising from Gehenna. Yep. Ghost rising from Gehenna. Happily steals the vi vitality. Okay. Vitality of the living. Yep. Back with these again. Oh my god. No. Bang. We need Kevin. Found fish darts. It's better to have been looted and lost than to have never been looted at all. So you accept your fate, Eric. Ah, fuck! <laughs> oh no! They got the ambush done. Ow. They took our AP! This is bad. You take either Ellie or. Ow. Courage. We got we got these things fast now. Alright. Go. 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 Bang. Burn it with fire! Shoot it! Bang. Go. Boom. There goes Randy. Finishing it off. Good job, Randy. Oh yeah. Nothing here. Really? Nothing here either. Gotcha. Yes. Mm -hmm. Ambush. Go. Kill them. All right. Found bomb right, bomb rice. This chest is important for shadowing. You just don't know yet. You just don't know yet. You just don't know it yet. Thank you. Damn it! Stop catching me. Gotcha. Right. Oh, you're fucked. Oh. Oops. 
Alright. Found courageous hot, hot pot. Randy met his match at the casino. A girl in a frilly white dress had a good hand and went all ran. Ha <laughs> ha! Shut up, Eric. Hmm. Eric knows something, he does. Can't trust him. Go! Oh, you're the dead. Go. Alright. Go. Again. We won again. <laughs> so now what is see. Here. Oh my god! What the hell are you guys? Yes. Just power them up. Go. We got two strange enemies here. The only one. The repeat. Hammer Dwarf Items Beast Flesh Carry a Bomb Information The malicious dwarf being with a hammer can cause various sta status abnormalities. And again. Virgin Item Celestial Bomb Smoke Grenade Information Guide to the Underworld Guide, Guide to the Underworld Hums a gloomy song Which invites death to all who hears it Wow What are you doing? Oh that It dies with an attack I'll do that. That's scary. Kill it! Oh my god! Lloyd just died a lot. Divide them again. Go. Oh, you son of a bitch! Nope, you're not gonna stop me, asshole. That fucker beat me. Go. Go. Here we go. One. <laughs> okay. What's over here? Gotcha. You're the only one there. Okay. Get your ass kicked. Go. Alright. Did 
the gate is locked. Unlock it? I don't know. The treasure up there. Okay. Let's see. What's down here though? I guess you have to go here. Gotcha, asshole. Let's see. I need to be very careful with these guys. Very careful. Go. Oh god. Yeah, they got like that. Oh my god! Okay, they just die even if you're fully recovered. Word of advice, get Lloyd away from these guys. Do not let Lloyd attack these guys. Only long range, long range um, people. Go. Everybody stay away from it. I'm getting the fuck away from it. Stay away from it. Stay away from it. Oh my god, that's the worst person to come after. Ellie does not like. Ah. Uh... Go. See what happens. Miss. Yeah, asshole. Screw you. Eddie was part of freaking out. He's like, oh god, don't come after me! Found EP charge too. I'd have a witty message, but our lead editor was too busy playing Final Fantasy <laughs> Final Fantasy 14. Screenshot this. <laughs> really? Really? I have a witty message, but our lead editor was too busy playing Final Fantasy 14. Speaking of Final Fantasy! <laughs> uh, what's up with this? You know, that just proves that this place is cursed. The game knows, this game knows everything. First, the shutting off in our conversation. God damn it! Oh, let's kill this guy. No, it's at 14. I think it's at 14. Oh, God. Boy, back away. Boy, back away. Everybody fight the fuck away from it. Yeah. Hey, we were just talking about Final Fantasy. <laughs> what are the odds of that? We were literally just talking about Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy. Leave the fuck alone. That is coming all the way down here, you fucking bitch! I hate these things. 
No way, Lloyd. These things not gonna let us out. If I was, Yo, we'll never know what the fuck that song means. There's a treasure one. There's the right path we're going to. Okay, there we go. What's over here then? Found action three. Just can't be arrested, you know. Oh my god! Is it was coming after us? Oh no, death! Oh god, who's gonna kill? Oh my god, that thing just... There. They saw us down... What? Fuck 
fuck you up. You get fucked. Oh, you get fucked. So. Lloyd, back away. There, one down. Bang. Die. Oh god, back away, back away, back away, back away. He's so jerk. Oh, he had, he had dead. We would have been fucked. We killed it before it did. Fucking damn it, man. Oh no, someone's gonna die. Oh, he's dead again. Oh, fuck off, man. Like, seriously, fuck off. Fuck off. Sateto. There we go, Lord of Fire. Again. Alright. Fuck off, bitch. Go. Leave her alone, fuck, man. There. Oh, we're on the other side now. Monsters, oh, fuck. This is bad. This is real bad. Oh, it's just like that. Shit. Delay them. Delay, delay, delay. Ha, assholes. Nothing. Go. Kill this fucker. 
there. That's so close, but we already killed the one that's annoying. All dead. You won. Alright. That's a bomb. One, smoke grenade, one, beast flesh, one. Found black suit. First, the bracer killed, then the CPD, and now the CGF is helping rob chest two? <laughs> uh, shut up. Battle jacket. That's for you. Match with Lloyd. Yeah, why not? Time back to the opening chest. <laughs> Mark it slowly because I want to get caught. <laughs> oh, this place is giving me the heebie jeebies. I think I know where we're at now in this part. Moon Temple, what? What the fuck is this? Oh, I got right towards it. Oh, well, we got the advantage, kind of. Ah, yes. Go. Why should it matter more? Go. Bang. That's scary. You can tell if it's gonna hit or not. Let's see. Down here, there's something up here. In the fuck alone. You wanna bring it, bitch? I got you, motherfucker. You wanna bring it? Then bring it. Go. Bang. 
Bang. All right. It's over here. Yeah. Wait, what? Where the fuck are we going? Oh, are you scared of us? <laughs> oh, we're back in the front! Ah! I'm like, wait, what? Where are we? Oh, recover! We need to recover. Good. That's actually smart. We're back at the entrance. Nice. Nice game, nice. Let's see. We're fully recovered, bitches. Oh yeah, we're back. Gate has already been unlocked. Okay. So I guess we keep going this way. Right? This way? Was this way? No, it wasn't this way. It's somewhere else. It's down here. Alright. So I was kind of going the right way. We've already been through here, so. Alright. Now we're here. Barely. What is that? What the hell is that? Oh, those are things that we fought in, um. In. Uh oh. Ow. Those are the things that we fought in, um. Chosen Sky. The third. Wisp. Items, Korea Bomb. Battle Scope. Information, evil spirit born from darkness in people's hearts. Heartless? Just kidding. Evil spirit born from darkness in people's hearts. Seals foes movement with breath. Yes? Go. It's a heartless. <laughs> oh god. Go ahead and finish it off. Bang. Alright. Wrong game. <laughs> I was an ugly enemy there with the horse. Uh, uh, uh. Let's see. They look disgusting. Why do they look all skin ripped? Uh. I don't like them. Don't kill it. We gotta scan it. Don't kill it. We gotta scan it. Please don't kill it. Okay, we're good. Don't kill it. There you go. Nightmare. Items. Korea bomb. Tira bomb. Information. A dread devil that looks like a horse. Destroys foes, mine, and freezes them. Go. Now that's why I call it We won. Alright. Gotcha. Mm-hmm. Go. Boom. 
Bye bye. You miss while he's dead. Alright. Let us go. Oh! Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Team Rush, are you dead? Go. Oh my god, that's a good... <laughs> Let's see. Oh my god, it's still coming after us. Leave, us Leave me alone. There. Oh, okay, I guess. Oh no. No. Miss. Go. Okay. Guard. Oh God. No. Bang. Let's see. Found Sessie Bomb. Rude. Rude. You're rude. You've always been rude. Go. Hmm. Oh, 
Oh my god, kill this stupid horse. Cut three. Bad news, pal. You're looking at the baddest Jake Jager in all of Chester and Zemuria. What? I guess. I'll give it to her. There you go. There's a switch here. Operate it? Yes. Nintendo switch. Alright, we did it. I think. I don't know. Really? What's down here then? Get over there. Alright. Or cover. Might be it. Why are the socks all crap out? There we go. <laughs> I think we're at the end of this part now. We good? You know what? Cause we see a bunch of death bullshit. I don't know. Maybe give it to Ellie as well. Hold on. Holy log it. Shining justice! <laughs> this place keeps getting stranger and stranger. Yeah, it's rubbing me the wrong way. Why the hell is there a place like this behind a chapel? It's not normal, that's for sure. These ruins are way too bizarre to have belonged to the Zipping Church. I'm curious about the meaning of that floor pattern there. It resembles an eye, doesn't it? When I must. <laughs> What's wrong, Tio? Did you notice something? There's a good chance that this place served as a sort of ritual chamber. A horrid place used to offer life sacrifice. Oh, oh my god! What's wrong with this place? A horrid place. 
workplace used to offer life sacrifices. S -s -s sacrifices? Don't creep the spell out. Yes, I imagine those stark red stains on the floor are from the victims of those blood. Oh my god, what is wrong with this game? Yes, I imagine those dark red stains on the floor are from the victim's spilled blood. Of course, I wouldn't know for sure without a proper composition, compos composition test. Well, this conversation sure got dark. This game got dark. Oh my god. But why would a place like this be behind the ruins of an old church? Because it's a cult! Again? What are we up against this time? It's death. It's a demon. That's all because of this. No way. Is that thing a devil? Yep. Please be careful. I'm detecting massive amounts of spiritual energy from it. Hey, I remember signing up to be a CPD exorcist. Kevin, we need you! Here it comes! Yeah, we need Kevin. Kevin, we need you. Where are you, Kevin? Kevin! Kevin, we need you. We'll find the devil here! Yep. The power of Ares compels you. <laughs> Get away. If they recover, what an ass. Arc Devil is preparing to cast Arc. This is bad. Why did you. Oh, you know I'm stupid. We can't. Well, I don't think I don't think it's possible with people, can you? Oh, Reese. Kevin Reese, we need you as soon as possible. We need the power of Aegos. Go. Work. Oh god, resist! Miss. Okay. Shoot it. Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> but no, de no delays. No delays. No resist delays. Oh, we're burnt. No, we're burnt. The power of Aiden compels you. <laughs> uh. Go. Call allies. What? Another one? Straight up times max. Go. Oh, God. Oh, no. We can't do anything with her. Except with arts. Pseudo-Rudo. I wanna say Pseudo-Rudo. Pseudo-Rudo! Pseudo-Rudo. Items, your material. Information, an evil statue made from a tough material, which expels fire from its mouth. We're scared of Reese with that holy water. <laughs> You're dead. Alright, that saves trouble. Get out of the way! Oh my god. That was crap! Let's go! 
work or works. Go. Get out of the way. Why can't you more? Impede himself, he don't need to do impede attacks. Huh? Why call him more? Fuck! <laughs> fire air is the fire air is the best. Oh man, is he gonna keep calling her what? Fuck! Fucker took our team much. Get out of the way. Oh, we're just running away. I'm getting annoyed by that shit. Recover and then cause. Recover, recover, cause. Recover and cause. Come on, man. That's so stupid. Right? Arch Devil. Oh, another word just analyzed. Arch Devil. 
Items, Duran Powder. Information, Dream Devil that slowly corrupts people. A single swing of its claws terrifies foes. Hey. Fuck, man. That's a good idea. Ow. Hmm. Hey, get up! Oh, Lord, you're gonna have to take the hit. If we don't, then something bad's gonna happen. See some recovery. Wow, man. Go. It's one died. Go. There, one's dead. Oh God. Oh. Look at the attack, man. Go. Go. Heal us. Both. Heal. Heal us a couple. Yes. Go. Bang! Why does that work at all? Well, kind of ish. Ow. No, the one that can stop this stupid thing is fucking um Lloyd not Lloyd, I mean Ellie. Be that fucker! Go. There it goes. <laughs> Miss, bitch. Let's get recover. What the point? This fucker's just gonna keep recovering! Go! They're all dead. I'm going to pause the hero. <laughs> if we get out of here. Go. Alright. I'm going to go all out with it. Can I speed again? No, because I tried to, but you can't. I have no I don't have items for it. Let me see. Okay. 
Asking me or, or giving me advice? I, it's not like you're asking. I don't know. I don't know how, how you're saying it. Let me see. Yes. There. All right. Look at Randy. Oh, here comes Team Rush. If that part doesn't do anything, here comes Team Rush. I don't think Seeker's work either, so... Yeah. Too much. You little bitch! Stop doing that shit! He just keeps taking our shit away! You know what? Go. Be that fucker. Don't let this asshole do anything. Go. Mm. Well, we passed the halfway point. Go. Break up. Go. Ow. We gotta do something anyway, so let me see. Let me see. Oh, we're gonna. Go. I can't really use you right now, so I don't think your S will your S press will matter. You can't do anything. Go. I don't want that fucking recover anymore. There we go. to face her fears. 
Go, Ellie and Lloyd. Face your fear, Lloyd. Ellie. Ellie. Face your fears. Face your fears. We won. Congrats, Ellie. There we go. Oh, yeah. Damn, that's a lot of red ones. You material times six. The random power to times one. Thank you. <sighs> that was annoying as fuck. You managed to take it down. But what an idiot's name was that? Now get the heck out of here. It looked like a devil straight from the church's testaments. Yep. Regardless of its regardless of its origin, it was emitting it was emitting a terrifying amount of spiritual energy. There's blood! <laughs> Ghosts, skeleton, monsters, and now we're fighting devils? This place is messed up, man. Given our current position, I'm pretty sure the bell's right above us. Let's take a look, everyone. Let's. There's blood! There's fucking blood! Oh my god, man! This is so scary! Fuck! Alright. People died here! Moon Temple Roof. Wait, what the fuck's up with the sky? Yo, what's up with the sky? Where are we? Are we in the same world right now? They look, they look weird now. Ring the bell. This sound. Look at it. The bell's resonating? It could be that. You know, that's part of the reason why this game never came over here. It could be that. Maybe that the bell's resonance is causing the atmosphere. The bell? Could you elaborate? Of course. I don't know the specifics. But I feel as if this bell is essentially the nucleus of the atmosphere covering this entire temple. In other words, if we can put an end to the resonance, maybe, just maybe, everything going back to normal? I guess so. What do you think, Sergeant Major? Should we give it a shot? Yes. Yes, let's do it. Lloyd, Randy, could you give me a hand? It'll be it will have to be a team effort. No problem. Yes, ma'am. Ring that bell. Ring it. Are you doing anything? Uh. There it goes. Yay! Everything's back to normal. The, the fog's gone. Yeah, looks like it. Blue skies return too. The atmosphere covering the temple seems to have dissip dissipated. Perhaps. The interior. It might have changed, right? We should head back inside and take a look. Roger. Let's see. There's still blood here. Fuck, this is scary. Let's see. Rest. No more ghost things anymore. Dog gone. Wonder, was, wonder what was that about? Like, who did that? Somebody has done it. Would you look at that? Wow. The sunlight's shining through. My monster radar ain't picking up any signals either. 
Yeah. Let's check out the lower. Let's check out the lower floor too. Let's check out everywhere. Why don't you? Oh wait, never mind. I no longer detect the presence of time, space, or mirage in the area. It appears as if the dis distorted space is returning back to normal. That's good to hear. But what exactly was the, but what exactly was the deal with this temple? There must have been a reason behind the strange resonance of that bell, right? Yep. Unfortunately, that's beyond my knowledge. However, I say that there's an extremely high possibility of that bell being an art artifact. An artifact? What's that? Artifacts are the remnants of the ancient Sumerian civil civilization that existed 1,200 years ago. They seem to hold powers beyond orbital technology and are under the strict control of the church. Yeah, you hear stories about those suckers from time to time. They're usually about some pompous rich guy who secretly had a crazy powerful one. Always ends with the church confiscating them, though. Yep, Kevin and Reese. We want that. Give it to us. Always ends up with the church confiscating them, though. Wow, this is news to me. First, I've heard of it as well. It's not surprising that the average person is unaware of their existence. After all, is it possible to analyze artifacts using current technology? Really? Either way, I think we've collected enough information here. Let's turn in let's turn in a report and leave further investigations to the specialists. I'm with you. Well, we did all we could. So, time to call it a day? Yep, sounds good. Everyone, thank you so much for your for your help with the investigation. With that, it's safe to say, mission accomplished. That's it? And we get out of here. That was weird, though. I mean, how did it happen, though? Who did it? Somebody did it. Most likely somebody did it. There's no... Oh, it just came out of nowhere. <laughs> it's a weird weather we have. Sometimes there's a weather where anonymous dark force takes over an area and you just got to deal with it and try to turn it off yourself. <sighs> it's finally over. Yes, Ellie. You finally faced your fear, didn't you? Or did you not? For a second there, I thought we were done for. Good work in there, everyone. I still can't get over the, that bell, though. Those monsters were absurd, too. Yes, they were. They're, they're, we're like, we're fine. It was like we're doing Gehenna's. I mean, we're doing Kevin's work again. Stargazer's tower. Stargazer's tower was mysterious, but this temple was really something else. Yep. Until the gospel break them. <laughs> I don't think she did. We need more ghost story for Ellie. Let's not forget that creepy ri ritual chamber behind the chapel. I honestly find it hard to believe such an ominous place was was once a church. What happened 500 years ago? Sacrifices, fuck. Well, I say we leave that question to the historians and get out of here. I expect that. I expected that place to be like a haunted house, but damn, that was nuts. It really was. Kevin Reese had one job. <laughs> anyway, should we head back to where we parked the car? Sounds good to me. We gotta walk over there? Oh, we gotta walk over there, do we? So there's no more monsters here? Everything's gone? Everything's gone. Are those tombstones? Are those are those fucking um ca coffins? 
don't know wherever they are. Yeah, there's more monsters. What? Aren't y'all weak to come after me? You little shits. Come here. Go. Go. Why am I so many misses? Stronger again? We're taking more damage now. Go. Nope. Punch though. Alrighty. Alright. Hmm. Oh my god, stupid. What's your plan? I still have a bit of time before I need to go. I need to be back. Need a ride anywhere? Hmm, let me think. If you're offering, we might as well take you up on it. Please, give us a ride. A call? Sorry, give me a minute. <laughs> kind of weird time for someone to ring. Hi. Hello, this is Lloyd Bennings, Special Support Section. Uh, um, it's Fran. Where are you guys? Where are you guys right now? Hey, Fran. Oh, we're in the tunnel on Main's mountain path right now. We just finished investigating some ruins in the area with your sister. How's everyone doing? Were you able to safely complete your investigation? Yeah, at least for now, anyway. Did you want me to hand her the phone? She's right here. What? Well, well. <laughs> no, that's okay. If I needed to talk to her, I would have just called her. Ig I would have just called her Enigma. Actually, there's someone who would like to ask. To okay, actually, there's someone who would like to ask the SSS a question or two. Oh sure, who is it? A citizen? Not quite. It's the mayor of Mainz. It sounds like he needs a consolation with your team. Oh really? It doesn't happen very often. Did he give you any details? 
Apparently, one of the locals from Baines went to the went to visit Crossbow City, but he hasn't returned for several days. What? At least, that's what I gathered from everything he told me. That sounds a little concerning. All right, we're already near Mainz, so we'll pay Mayor Bixen a visit. Fortunately for us, your sister can give us a ride there. <laughs> Don't be afraid to work. Don't be afraid to work her to the bone. I'll go ahead and contact the mayor to let him to let him know you're coming in advance. Was that friend? Yeah. She called to tell us about a new request. Lloyd gave a short summary of what Fran said. Hmm, I see. Mayor Bixen submitted a, a support request. Someone visited the city and has yet to return home? May as well head on over and hear this and hear the story straight from the man himself. Yeah, I was thinking the same. Alright, all right, Sergeant Major. Could you take us to Mainz? Leave it to me. All right, we're going to Mainz. Oh, that's all you gotta do. You gotta go to Mainz. What happened? All right, we made it. I'm always impressed by how much faster we travel with your car. Let's hurry and ask the town for details on the case. Sounds good, man. If I remember correctly, it was the house in the back of town. She's still with us. She's still with us. <laughs> Do what you have to say. Come on. This way leads to the highway. It'd be a waste to leave without even speaking to the mayor. Okay, use the car. We're stuck. Oh, looks like it's getting dark. I bet my brother Loggy is going to be cranking is going to be cranky cranking when he gets home from work. I know they've been working him hard lately. Alright. Everybody got else everybody got something new to say, but thank goodness Maze is small. Oh, you're that sports session that the mayor asked for help. Oh, you're that special sports session that the mayor asked for help from, right? Thanks for coming. The mayor's house is the furthest on is the furthest one back. The mayor's house is the furthest one back. Hmm. You look exhausted. How about you go and take a quality nap at our inn? That should be it for cleaning. Gas being here or not, cleaning isn't usually very hard to take care of. Hmm. You know, I think it's one of my favorite town themes. That's so desolate. Let's see. Kimmy, sorry, but could you bring me, you know what, from the shelf? Okay, just one second. Can't you see that I'm busy? What do you need? My daughter grew up into such a smart and sharp-eyed girl. Heck, I'm just glad she didn't end up looking like me. <laughs> I love to help Daddy, and I know Daddy loves it when I help him. Hmm. Well, those are we can't apologize to Harold. We can't go to a crossbow today. Or I don't know. I was just one I was just out delivering my husband's lunch boxes to him earlier. The way his face lights up when he sees his food always puts me in a good mood. <sighs> Without Gantz here, war just hasn't been the same. Since 
guess is is who knows where. I can't slack off. Come back, you jerk. What the fuck? Where in the world has Gas run off to? Eh, whatever. Nothing to do but mine and mine and mine some more. So, can you guys please mind your own business? Shoot, I just noticed a hole in this pipe. Did some rats shoot through it or something? Gotta plug it up either way. Marlow, and even he doesn't know where Gaz went off to. I wonder what happened to him. Somebody's missed. So some, some Gaz the one is missing. Amazingly, Loggy has actually been taking his job seriously for once. I'm convinced that he's only able to focus because that Gaz isn't there to distract him. That's my stuff. Even though Gaz is missing, at least I'm not here to strike my son, my my grandson. My husband has been telling me all about how hard Loggy's been working lately. Could it be? Has Loggy finally learned what it takes to be a miner? Hmm, maybe. Support section. Yes, yes. I've been waiting for you all. What's going on? Apologies for, apologies for making you come all this way. Should be told, I intended to go see you in the city march. Please, don't worry about that. We were in, we were in the area, so stopping by wasn't inconvenience or anything. So, would you mind explaining the support request to us? Of course. Please take a seat. I'll pour some tea. Just one second. Make it sound like you mean the sorry. <laughs> I see. In summary, one of your miners, Gens, traveled to Crossbow City almost two weeks ago and hasn't been back since? Yes, precisely. You see, he's a gambler at heart. People have, ever, people have even told me that he would go to the city entertainment district on weekends to gamble on, at the casino. The fact that he hasn't contacted anyone for two whole weeks has us worried. Everyone around town is wondering where he's gone, or if something happened to him. That's definitely strange. There may be some specific reason he hasn't returned, such as being involved in an, in an accident. Hmm. At the very least, I hope he wasn't attacked by the monsters that have started to appear on the city outskirts. What if the miner is just a damn good gambler? A guy could make a killing in the casino if he plays his cards right. If I were him and that happened, I'd be chilling in Mishlam with a drink in one hand and the other around a pretty lady's waist. <laughs> yeah, I doubt that's the case. For starters, he isn't you. <laughs> Randy makes a valid point about gambling, though. We cannot ignore the possibility. Hmm. I don't mean to interrupt, but I don't see that happening. What? Why is that? He said he loves to gamble. Are there any other relevant qualities about him he, we should know of? <laughs> well, Gas is the least serious person I've ever had the pleasure of knowing, but... While he may can love gambling to death, He's absolutely horrible at it. On top of that, he's got the luck of a man who would keel over it for, from a splinter every time he comes home. His wallet is as dry as a desert. Wow. I, I see. In that case, he might make some cash in the lottery, but without any real skill, 
I doubt he'd win much in the poker game. Perhaps he took out a sum of Mira and ran off before the lone sharks could catch him? Well, that's another possibility to consider. That was actually one of the scenarios we considered before you arrived. Though, if that was true, I think we would have heard from him by now. Understood, Mayor Bixen. Mayor Bixen, you can leave fighting against to us. For now, we'll start with the we'll start with investigating the, the casino and other places he may have visited. Thank you, Lord. I'll leave this matter in your hands then. If you learn anything, could you contact my house by my phone? Of course, sir. Let me write down your phone number while I'm, while I'm here. Is Sunset! It's already evening. It's probably, about, it's probably about time we head back to Crosbo City. We still need to gather more information before the day is done, so yes. We should return before it gets dark. Could you give us a ride, Noel? Yes, of course! Hop in, and we'll move out. Something tells me. We talk to more people, I guess. I wonder where Gaz ran off to. He's usually, he's usually only gone for about three days, but no one's been able to find him. Gaz, what the fuck happened to you? Logan, Logan and Amy should be getting back any minute now. I think I'll have to prepare a special dinner tonight, since loggy has been working so hard recently. Then we fucked up, he got killed. Because he wanted me. I don't know. If I have the time. Wait. If I have the time. If I have the time right. The miners, the miners should be heading home right about now. I imagine they want to soothe their aching bones and get ready for tomorrow. Hmm. Oh, we messed up, he got killed. Work's finally over. I'm pooped. I think I'll just go home and relax. I got a, I got a, I got a bruised rib from being elbowed in soccer last night. Still hurt now, so I'm just going to be chilling and taking a lot of rest. Hey man, if it's too much, you could just rest. You could take a rest, dude. I don't want my streaming to bother to me to disturb that, you know. So yeah, get well, dude. That sucks. Carlos looks pretty torn up over Gaz having gone missing. I don't think he should beat himself up over it though. He honestly takes everything far too seriously. Ask me, I'm Carlos. <laughs> we, have, we have those monsters attacks and now one of our miners has gone missing? Hard to believe all this craziness has happened in the, in the span of, of a few months. Hopefully. This isn't this isn't this isn't a sign of things to come. You're foreshadowing it. Hmm. Gas must really suck at gambling. Whenever he gets wasted here, that's all he ever complains about. I don't want to hear about every hand he's ever lost, you know? Damn. Nice! Enjoy that pizza! That's rude, he's missing your you're talking shit. Gus burnt practically all his money on gambling, so he's built off quite the impressive tab there. Tab here. Damn it. If that idiot doesn't come back safely and pay up, I'm going to lose it. Make sure you're okay, guys, so you can pay the fuck me, so you can pay me whatever the fuck you owe me. What should we have what should we have for dinner tonight?
mining crew carries the weight of the town on their shoulders. That's why Mayor Bixen makes sure to always treat them well. Hmm. It's been almost two weeks since we've had any sort of party. One of our co-workers is missing, so it's kind of tasteless to go celebrating. I'm hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry! Gaz and I have been friends ever since we were kids, you see. So whenever he's not around, everything just feels kind of wrong. Hmm. Is today's shift over already? Even ever since Gaz disappeared, the whole crew has been really inefficient. For better or worse, that guy knew how to get us pumped up. I need to follow my own advice. Huh. I don't know what happened to him, but please, find him as soon as you can. I know that in, I know that the entire mining crew is extremely worried about him. <laughs> yep, I'll leave this entire situation with guts to you. If you figure anything out, please do not hesitate to contact me. Hmm. I know, right? I take my own advice. <laughs> All right, here we go. Ah, Norimaska. Right in the Guardian Force cart. Project oh, Studio. Yep. Here we go. And here we go. Back in town. I have a feeling we're talking to a lot of people again. Thank you for your help today, everyone. Trust me, I plan to return the favor as soon as I can. I think you're giving us too much credit here, Sergeant Major. Yeah, dude. We should be thanking you for inviting us on this crazy adventure. Guys, about what happened in the temple. What? I think we should contact Crossbow Cathedral and have them sort things out from here on. I concur. If the ruins are in fact related to an artifact, our hands are tied. Are we the Kevin and Reese? Right. That make it that'd make it the church's jurisdiction. Either way, I'll discuss things with the deputy commander and figure out what to do. So, are you guys going to start asking around the city now? Yes. Yep, started with the casino. Can you contact us? Can you contact us? Wait, can you, could you contact us if the CGF learns anything? About Gans, you mean? Of course. Anyway, I'll let you guys get back to work. Good luck! <laughs> you too, Noel. She's great. I love you. Well then. Ready to stop by the casino? Ready to stop by the casino? Remember, we don't have too much time to waste. That will be the greatest thing ever. Let's go. There's still a lot we don't know about Gans. Well, what are we waiting for? To the entertainment district. Da -da 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 right, it doesn't work that way. Shut up. Okay, never mind. Thank you. No talking. <laughs> Great. He's like, nah, don't worry, I got you. We're talking here, of course. About time for business at the casino to really pick up. You guys ready? Let's find ourselves a miner and hit the slots, too. We're only going to be doing one of those things, Randy. Considering we aren't uncovered, considering we aren't undercover, there's a positive, there's absolutely zero reason for us to play. Agreed. Anyway, Let's just stick with questioning employees and customers. Perhaps that will lead to some clue about Gant's whereabouts. Yeah, yeah. Bunch of killjoys. <laughs> Let me get some snacks real quick. I'm gonna find something. If I can't find nothing, well, oh well. BRB. BRB!
Sorry guys, I'm trying to order something. I'm hungry as fuck. Trash, trash. Okay. Give me one sec. I'm having trouble ordering food. Apparently, my, I don't know anywhere else but McDonald's over here. Closes at 11. Fuck. <laughs> Chicken nuggets. <laughs> No, no food right now. They got chicken nuggets at McDonald's. I mean, they got chicken nuggets at Jack in the Box? No fuck, let's try them. Let's see. I was like, you, you know what? I, sh I should, but mm, my brother's the one that does all that. I mean, I don't have. My brother has like the little website where I don't know. He always like, wants him to order. Like, I always try to order, but he's like, no, let me order. I don't know. I think he has something. But I guess he's with him. Then again, I don't want to order pizza just for me. For me, so you know, with me, so I'm like, eh, I guess I'm gonna I want. I'm craving chicken. Sorry. Give me one second. I'm still trying. Yeah. <laughs> and I was gonna say, like, why don't you just get pizza? Like, eh, I want to get pizza, but. Mm. Craving chicken. <laughs> That's so weird. How come McDonald's has like meal option, but it doesn't have meal option? But Jack in the Box has no meal option. I want some water, bro. The burger got that yesterday. Oh, I think there it is. Hold on. I think I found it. I'm stupid. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Okay. Just stop me, why don't you? Chicken nuggets or chicken strips? 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 I wanted to try how the chicken nuggets are like. I ate too many chicken strips in that place every time I get some chicken. Every time I go there. Go with chicken nuggets. And like my friends. Whoop. Large curry fry. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> oh, my controller dropped. No. Sorry. 
take a picture drink. I thought it was like easy ice, just ice, like you want easy ice, extra ice, or no ice. Just put ice, what the fuck, okay, guess easy ice, whatever, I don't care about easy ice. Can I read you or what? To us, I just looked up that McDonald's is closed right now. They close at 11. Oh, where is it? Okay, there we go. I'm stupid. Okay, there it goes. And where is my thing? Oh, that's dog. Oh, I think I found it. Yeah, chicken sandwich on the side. Chicken teriyaki bowl? Try that. Mm, I just been this challenge. What about like for the for Dragon Ball Z? Now, they better deliver. Jack is open. I know Jack is open 24 7. I think all my restaurants near me are closed. You talking to me or you talking to um, Kaz? Oh, by the way, Kaz, happy. Hey, okay, everybody, guys, shout out to Kaz. This is his birthday today. Happy birthday, Kaz. Now we have a session of stuff. It's not McDonald's. It's not McDonald's because McDonald's can't do it. Okay, so 847 with the chick with the large fries, large fries, large chicken nuggets. And chicken sandwich. Yes, they could they could deliver. Fuck yeah. Who's gonna bring it? So we'll see. Now let's play while I wait. <laughs> I, you know what? I am. I feel so horrible. I need to follow my own advice. Like go get your snacks, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, or dessert, and let's be. Sake to. You can right here, like. <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> yes, go get your snacks. Oh, can't. Yes. Yes. He is indeed one of our regulars. He was a casual gambler with a with a penchant of for losing until recently. I think I better I think it'd be better if you heard the details from the owner though. But yeah, because McDonald's is closed right now, they don't deliver right now. Of course. So yeah. 
You'd be correct. Gas is indeed one of our regulars. I think it'd be better if you heard the details from the owner, though. Oh, so you gotta talk to the owner. Oh, there was food, though. I guess I went, I went over there at the kitchen like, there's nothing to eat. They're like, no, there's nothing. I mean, I got Oreos, but that's too much. Oh, I got the, oh yeah, did I ever, did I ever talk to you guys about how obsessed I am with Oreos when it comes to collecting flavors? Okay, I heard that Gans used to be a third-rate gambler. Is that really the truth, though? I failed to get that impression from him at all. I too have foolishly challenged him before. I didn't sense that he was the least bit inept. Don't black out screen, what the fuck? Okay. Anyways, I didn't sense that he was the least bit inept. I'm gonna tell all the flavors later. I've all tried. You're gonna be like, what? You like to know about Gantz? Yeah, he's a regular. You still only come on weekends, though. I think you'll be able to get more details out of the owner. Lunch dinner. I was about to be <laughs> But anyway, guys, as I said before, shout out to Cass's birthday. Happy birthday, Cass. Hope you had a good, safe one, too. I mean, even it wasn't as, maybe it wasn't how you planned it. People like, I want to throw a big party. You know what? It's okay. You're right here now. You are given, you made it this far for your birthday. Make, and hopefully, you make it to your other ones and so on. So, happy birthday, Cass. Me and you may have our moments. Me and you... May go, may, may um argue sometimes. I'll admit that. But you're still a cool guy. You're a friend, and you're very supportive. Thank you so much, dude. I feel like you're the only one. I mean, with our situation back in the past, I feel like you're the only one that stood there. That stayed. You are. You are the only one that stayed. So, I thank you for being here. All the way. I thought it was just that little group chat back in the past in the past that it was just I thought it was just that thing that we only are interested of and then we never talk again like everybody else but you still you stayed and yeah, I really appreciate it dude we got to know each other more and all that so thank you for being here you want you want to know about Gantz you should probably talk to the owner about him he's usually up for a chat over at the bar So shout out to Kaz, to Kaz again. Happy birthday. This dark out already? I'm having such a good time though. I don't want to go home. I'm still on a galley high. Go home, sir. You've been here every fucking play every time we visit here. It's dark out already? I wanna stay here. Sir, we're closing. Hmm. Good evening, everyone. Have you all come to play with Randy? Damn it, my fork is blacking out. Oh, they're coming. The car's moving. The car's moving. Oh, they're already coming. They're already coming. Oh, shit. They're already coming. No, not today. We actually want to ask you something. Lloyd asked about the missing miner. Missing? That's preposterous. He came here earlier. Guy managed to make a killing too. Stop blacking out, phone. Fuck. Is there a way to put a time limit on shit? Wait, really? And he was winning, you say? Come on, Drake. You must be thinking of someone else, right? You see, we're looking for a miner from Mains. I doubt he has the, I doubt he has the skill or intuition needed to stay afloat here. I'm, I'm scared. They're not fucking my order. I assure you, I know the man. 
It all started about two weeks ago. I mean, it's still at the place. I think it started picking it up. And then they're gonna come. It all started about two weeks ago. It'd been a while since I last saw him. But I swear it was like he was a complete different person. Thanks to him. My dealers are in the middle of losing streak or losing streak. We lost almost 500,000 mira to him now. 500,000 mira to him now? What? 500,000? That's a lot. That is an ex exorb exorbitant amount of money. I don't know what the fuck. I don't say that word. I'm sorry. I said that word. I'm sorry. There's no freaking way, man. He's gotta be cheating, right? As I'm sure you know, we are professionals. If someone was cheating, you would notice. Besides, he not only he not only has shown incredible talent, but miraculously, but miraculously, good luck as well. Everybody here would like to know how in the world he turned into a Kelly. Venom. Interesting. This is quite different from the story Mayor Bixen gave us. Excuse me, sir. Apparently, Gans hasn't returned to Mengs yet. Do you have any idea where he's staying? Oh, uh, yes. Last I heard, he stayed at the hotel across the street. Oh. The deluxe suite on the top floor, no less. Well, I guess he does have the mirror up for it. Seriously though, that place is crazy expensive. In any case, I am surprised we were able to find him like this easily. Likewise, we should go and pay him a visit. Guess is one of our regular patrons. I would have remembered if he had come today. I believe he's staying in the deluxe suite on the top floor of the Hotel Millennium. It might be a wise idea to visit him yourselves. It's picking up the food, it's not, not, I mean, it's picking up the food right now. It's still, it's not moving, that means it's picking, it's very picking up the food. Can we walk over there or what? Hey, it looks cool at night. What can we visit here at night again? It's already night time. We need to go speak, we need to go and speak with Gans. Right, let's head over to the hotel. The VIP rooms are on the top floor. Imagine hitting the jackpot and living the ball there by in a five-star hotel. Damn, I'm jealous as hell. Focus on the problem at hand, Randy. We're exploring at night! Sweet! Guess you should be staying in the fancy hotel over there. Let's pay him a visit. There you go, guys. We cannot go see um Harold. We gotta go see the Hayward, see? Nope, we can't see the Haywards. Nope. Where's the party going to take me tonight? Hmm. Okay, it's time to play all night. First thing first, it's time to hit up the casino and try my luck. Hi, how are you all doing tonight? Come on down to the Parker Casino for a good time. Are you actually going? <laughs> I'd be lying if I said if I wasn't at least a little bit interested. Nah, no one wants to rob a motorcycle delivering food at night. Hopefully, end of the stream, you can see the Hayward family. <laughs> Are you sure it's all right? I'm definitely interested, but I'm not. But, but, but I'm a little nervous about it. <laughs> Come on now. Do we look like a bunch of crook folks to you? <clears throat> Keep this a secret from my wife, will you? Wow. Out in the town for out in the town for a night of fun? Why not come in for some fantastic wine? Heh, <laughs> you're in a group of four, so you've scored yourself a party discount. Give us some thought, why don't you? What? 
Okay, it's time to play all night. First thing first. It's time to head up the casino and try my luck. Hmm. My daughter and wife still haven't returned from shopping. Hmm. This sucks. I think I'll head back to the hotel for now. Hmm. You're still here? Crossbow is dazzling during the night. Crossbow da is dazzling during night time. I'd go out and enjoy myself if I didn't have the business to run. Being a merchant is tough work. Is this my fate? Girl, why do you see ice cream at night? It's almost time for the performance. My heart feels like it's going to explode. They're still, they're still there? The entertainment district has a crazy life, nightlife. Damn, if only I had managed to snag me some tickets. I'd be enjoying the new Arkansas show in a minute. Hmm. Yeah, I should be staying at the place a little bit. We can't go anywhere else. Arkansas show is starting any minute now. It's certainly tempting, but I think we should check on Gans first. He should be staying at the hotel over there. Tonight's performance has yet to begin. Come by at a later time. Oh, we come over here? Sweet! Not but an ice cream stand at night? I reserve a room on the top floor with my wife. This is my favorite place to stay whenever I come to Costco. Hmm. Hotel Millennium has been famous for a long time. Due to his lecturer's services, it's my personal credit to always stay in places you can trust. Hmm. Um, is it coming already? I'm gonna have to get the I'm gonna have to get the table ready. Okay, then we'll get the table ready real quick. I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put my table outside. Ah! Give me one sec. Okay, I'm back. Walking around, talking to people at night, going to the casino at night. Uh, 
bad guys in the area. At night. George Woodward sends this. Okay, yes, I understand sending ice cream at night, but a f ice cream stand? You know how dangerous that is at night? Go get your ice cream at night. <laughs> but then again, to be fair, she's in the middle of the city. See? She's good, there's people around. There's lights everywhere, so she's good. Thank you. Oh, would you be staying here for the night? We have one vacant room cur currently available. Please make a decision ASAP. One empty room? Um, Lloyd, L L I think we should stay here for the night. Why is that, Ellie? Um, it's kind of late to go back, don't you think? Yes, I agree. I think we should. Brandy, no. Not you. Brandy. Well, then, I'll just go have fun then. Well, I guess it's just three of us. No, Tio, you go back home. What? Um, Ellie? I said let's stay for the night, Lloyd. Anyways. Oh, will you be staying here for the night? Okay. Hmm. Still dangerous for her. Yep. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. What's that over here? Is that him? That might be him. Tips are entirely at the at the patron's dis discretion. So please calm down, Dory. This isn't something we should be discussing in front of the other guests. Okay. Has I received an outrageous tip from a guest staying on the top floor? What am I even supposed to do with this huge wad of mirror? Do I tell the manager? Wow. That guy's living a life now. Oh, Dad, why do you always feel the need to be so pompous? What a wonderful night we're having. All the time for some vintage wine. <laughs> so this is all stuff that happens at night, huh? Some parts. Our deluxe suites are on, t on the top floor of the hotel. Just head up the stairs near the reception desk to get the to get to the deluxe suites. Hmm. It's him. It's him. No question about it. Is that is that you, Randy? Oh my! Long time no see. <laughs> Pleasure seeing you again. Who the hell are you people? Excuse us, sir. We're with the CPD. You must be guns from Mainz. That's right. Ain't I met you somewhere before? Have we? I recognize this man. Did we not save him from a ward pounds during the Mainz incident? Oh, you're right. Oh, it's that guy with the long hair. Oh, of course it's him. We saw him during the festival too. That indeed was him. <gasps> think I think I remember now. <gasps> Y'all those kids from way back then, ain't ya? <laughs> so, what you want? Well, we received a request from the mayor of Mainz. A request to track you down. The mayor is looking for me? What for? Come on, man. You've been here for, you've been here for like two weeks without contacting anyone, yeah? Everyone's all worried about you. They thought you went missing. They thought you went missing. As such, we were requested to find you. Okay. 
Well, you found me. Congrats. So can you go ahead and buzz off for... So can you go ahead and buzz off now, eh? I ain't ever going back to that hellhole for as long as I live. <laughs> Why's that? For what reason? <laughs> ain't it obvious? I'm the great greatest gambler this day has ever seen. And, and it ain't just my killer skill at tables. <laughs> oh yeah, Lady Luck is my bitch too. Wow. Who the hell would want to go back to Mainz to the smash rocks all day long? <gasps> Wait a second. I should, just, I should just, just leave him. Watch it. Are you sure that's what you want? Everybody's worried sick about you. You could at least contact the mayor and give him some peace. Shut up! Just shut up! You can't order me around like this, kid! Yeah, yeah just leave him. <laughs> One more round of, at Barca, and it'll be off to miss that for me. Hey, ladies, how about I take you to that fancy smashies resort this weekend? You can pick whatever you want from those boutiques they got, too. <laughs> Bill's on me. Wow, really? <laughs> I can't wait to go. Just leave him. Let him, let him go through. Let, let him suffer. He's gonna watch. Karma's gonna be a bitch, and he's gonna fucking um lose all that. There ain't much we can do about him. Dude's way too full of himself. Yeah, you're probably right. Regardless, we're still obligated to inform the mayor of the situation. Let me check the police. Is there a right to force him to return to Mainz? Nope, it's not. Let him decide to be a dumbass. What's already here? What's already here, guys? BRB.
Time to eat good, sweet. Oh yeah. Go get your snacks, breakfast, lunch, or dinner. In this case, mm, this is kind of like dinner. I got my chicken nuggets, curly fries, um, chicken sandwich, a large drink sprite. Karma a bitch. Why karma a bitch? Oh. Thank you. Let's see. What I do first is, guys, you're gonna call me weird, but am I the only one who eats fries before the main meal? Thank you. Anyways. It's not our right to force him to return to Mainz. Indeed, it was his own concession decision. You do too? Oh! You always call me weird! Exactly! Exactly! No, but I eat fries first because it's always best for last, and of course, because of that. That's a good reason. I know because I mean, because of that too. They they go still fast, so I eat them first. Mm. Mm. What's in your mind, Lloyd? You looks you look like something's bothering you. Can I help you, Lloyd? Is there anything I can do for you, Lloyd? 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 Yeah, so here's the thing. He was just an he was just an amateur gambler who played casually. I doubt he's nearly luck I doubt he's nearly lucky or sharp enough to be good. Yet somehow he's su he's suddenly on multiple win streaks. No matter how I analyze the situation, it just doesn't add up. Sometimes me too. Depends where I'm eating at. That's true. Yeah, that sure sounds fishy to me. You think he'd tell you think he'd tell me all his tricks if I You think he'd tell me all his tricks if he if I butter him up with a few drinks? Are you not already a skilled gambler, Randy? Only when I'm on a hot only when I'm in a hot streak, my friend. Not a chance in hell I I, I pull off wins for two consecutive weeks and win half a million Mira. Pretty sure you only be able to pull that off if you were as skilled as Jack. Jack? Jack? There you go, look at that real. Jack's a fictional character, Randy. Jack? Oh my god, screw Jack. That was a long night. <laughs> That was a long night. That one stream. Hmm. Alright. Jack's official character, Randy. Oh. What the heck? You guys were still around? Whoa, take it down a notch, sweet cake, sweet cheeks. Can I ask you two honey something real quick? I'm just a little curious about this gas fellow in there. Go right ahead. Ooh, what is it? Is he involved in some sort of crime? Maybe. Nah, it ain't nothing like that. Just wondering if he's if he's always been such an arrogant jackass. Even with the few drinks he had, he laid the attitude on a bit thick, eh? Hmm, yeah, I can see what you mean. It's true, he wasn't nearly as cocky when he first started gambling. But 
But as time went on, his victories began to feed his ego. You know what, guys? I feel like if I ever... I'm never going to do that. If I ever win... If I ever gamble once, like in a casino, and like, you know, like over there in Las Vegas... I told myself, if I ever win $100,000, like, would you like to go for a million? Like, no. I'm good. <laughs> it's going to help me pay off my own. It's going to help me pay off the stuff that at home, so I'm good. I never take risks like that, ever. Never. Like, I'm good. I got 30000 for this. And a couple money for probably get another house. And this rest of the money for me. Yeah. No, we were just hostess. So we don't really mind. Yeah? I see, I see. So it's safe to say that the arrogance wasn't coming, wasn't steaming from alcohol, right? Personality aside, that man is something else. It's almost as if he could see through the cards with, while they were laid down. He must have razor sharp senses. That's cheating. No kidding. It's really insane, to be honest. He even won straight up bets at the roulette table too. So this is off. You think he can read the dealer's mind? That doesn't sound most impressive. <sighs> Sounds more like a superpower than being perceptive. Damn it! Why couldn't Aeos have blessed me with such wonderful talents? <laughs> anyway, that's all about we know about Gans. Are we good to get? Are we good to get back to work? Yep, you've been real helpful. I think I'll come see you cuties again when I get some free time around here. Tee? <laughs> I won't get my hopes up, but I'll be waiting for you. Anyway, I'm going back. I'm going to go back to work now. Hmm. In any case, we should convey this information to the mayor. Yeah, give me a second. I'll call him. Lloyd pulled out Mayor Vixen's phone number and dialed it. You know, when every time I get curly fries, there's always a fr regular fry in it. Bannings, Bannings from the SS. <laughs> oh, so you've called. Were you able to find any information on Gantz? Well, about that. Lloyd explained everything that happened to Mayor Bixen. I am finding it hard to believe that such a thing has happened. Am I like Gantz, striking riches from gam gambling and living in luxury hotel? We tried to reason with him. But he refuses to return to Mainz. So we figured the least we could do was report the situation to you. Oh no. You've done you've done exemplary work. This is truly the case. I shall make my way to the city tomorrow and speak with Gans directly. Thank you for your hard work. We're just doing our job, sir. If we if we can be if, if we can be of further assistance. And please don't hesitate to contact us again. We'll keep helping if we can. Thank you. I'll be counting on you all. What did the mayor say? Well, he was definitely surprised about Gans. He said he'd be coming to Crossbow City tomorrow so he can speak to him. Dull is a better man for the job, to be honest. What's wrong, Tio? You've been quiet for a while now. Is something bothering you? No, not particularly. It was a long day, so I am feeling a bit fatigued. Oh, no kidding. Investigating those ruins earlier took a toll on me. The sun has already set, so perhaps we should return home. 
Kia's awaiting our return, right? Kia! Indeed she is. It is as if my exhaustion is completely erased when I see her smile. Aww. <laughs> I don't know if I'd go that far. I do get what you mean, though. Jeez, talk about our group of dotting parents, eh? Let's hurry on home and see our little keto. Keto. It appears to be locked. So I guess it's passed out drunk. Shall I return to the SSS building? He is waiting for us back there. Yeah, good call. Alright. Oh. It's the same thing. Hmm. All right. So we're going to. Sorry, no finish fries. <laughs> oh shoot! More talking. Well, I don't think it's that much, anyways. It's just here and then going back home to the thing. Okay, I found I found like four pieces of regular fries in my credit fries. Yep. I think I see another one at the bottom. <laughs> hey, Dumban, we got an order of two big, two big, two big nuggets. I mean, I mean, two burgers and. Two small fries. I don't have time for small fries. <laughs> and so everybody always gets either large or regular. Old but gold. I go regular. I go large. Let's see. Hurry up, Mom. It's going to start any minute now. I'm going to be very upset with you if we get if we miss if we miss Elia's performance, mother. Oh man. Let's see, section B seat twenty-eight two. Looks like it's on the right side of the theater. Alright, it's time to go. I finally get to watch an Arkansas show. Hey, look who it is! Welcome. Please allow me to examine your tickets. If you come to pur if you keep to purchase, do note that our normal seats are currently sold out. Ten more mi ten more minutes until the performance starts. I'd love for all our guests to enjoy the show. Look who it is! No tickets, no entry. Got it? Don't try don't try any funny business, pal. I've got my eyes on you. What will I do? Welcome to Arkansas. The trope will be performing Golden Sun Silver Moon tonight. 
I hope you all enjoyed every last second of it. I hate you the most. <laughs> Oh, I need to excuse myself to, to the restroom. I'm sorry, but could you wash my seat? What are you talking about? Aren't those seats reserved? <laughs> I unexpectedly received tickets from my job. So we get to come watch the show. Aren't we just the luckiest bunch? <laughs> the S... The, these S section seats are fantastic. There's no better way to fully appreciate the artistries other than sit in the section in the S section. I watched the perform on the open day, but the excitement from it never went away. I've been buying tickets non-stop because I can I can't stop thinking about them. Arkansas's play is finally here. Woo! Lady Leah! I'm also interested in that rising star of theirs, Michelle Mao, me too. She's got quite the reputation, so I'm excited to see whether she lives up to it or not. Dad, when is it going to start? I'm so bored of waiting. I came all the way out from the Empire to just for this day. I can't wait to see this. This is my first time watching Ark and Cell perform. I've, I've heard their new production is super popular, so my expectations are high. Hmm. I took the plunge and bought tickets for the S section seats. I'm sweating bullets here. This is the least I could do to make this proposal go off without a hitch. Good luck, sir. Okay, sweet. I got the tickets. Not only that, but there's S, but there S section seats. Wow, he's a lot bolder than I give him credit for. Hmm. Oh! Oh man, this view is pretty sick, don't you think? He's still here? <laughs> There's still 10 minutes until the performance starts, so sit tight. I hope you enjoy Golden Sun's Silver Moon to your heart's content. I'm showing one of our special guests to their seat. I have to say, he's a bit of a strange one. What kind of, what kind of connection does he have to be considered a special guest at this age? Look who's here. What the heck? What are you doing here, Vector? <laughs> Isn't it obvious? I'm here to watch Arkansas. Boy, I thought I wasn't gonna make it on time, so I started sprinting here. <laughs> I feel you there, man. Wait, hold on just a damn sec here. Aren't these seats for special guests? These seats shouldn't be available to the average person, no. Well, about that. The chest <laughs> I mean, can I use Graham's sweet benefits for my own enjoyment every once in a while? His behavior is incomprehensible. Hey, this is like one of my comfy couch to me. I think I'll snooze until the show starts. His behavior is absolutely incomprehensible. Well, Lecter's here. But they went back. Well then. Oh, there's some beauties here. Hold on, you want to I'm gonna go check. Look at Nicole building up some confidence, eh? <laughs> is he causing trouble again? He probably is. I was pretty worried there. He was in a rut for a while. Tried to kick some ass during today's practice. <laughs> Alright. My apologies. The performance is moments away from beginning. Please refrain from going backstage, as it as it is currently prohibited. Hmm. 
Don't you think that Nicole, Nicole has dramatically improved? He used to hesitate far, far more, but it's almost as if he's become a different person. <sighs> Perhaps he has managed to make a breakthrough. I, I do say, Nicole has become s strikingly different. I suppose he has been s training his hardest. Alright. Shut up, you trap, Eugene. Shut your trap, Eugene. You're disturbing my reading time. Hmm. Seriously? You're going to delay the show by doing that now? You're going to, you're going to, you're going to delay the show by doing that now? Oh, don't be so dramatic. I still have 10 minutes until it's go time. Come on, Karelia. Make it snappy. Okay. Oh, it's Cecile's little brother and his friends. Good evening, Leo. How are you? We all we all getting we all getting ready to perform now? Yep, you betcha. The attendees are bound to arrive soon. I think I'll focus on getting my steps down a little more cleanly cleanly for this scene. Alright, let's do this. It's time to kick some butt. She's as motivated as ever. Right. It's a strangely reassuring sight. I'm going to focus on getting my steps down a little more cleanly for that scene. Alright, let's do this. It's time to kick some butt. Oh, Rishia, I love you. Oh, you're here. Are you here to watch the show by any chance? I wish, but sadly not. We have business to attend to nearby, so we figured we'd drop by and say hi. I see. I see. I appreciate you I appreciate you visiting us. Thanks for working so late to keep us all safe. I think I'm finally getting the hang of controlling my nerves in front of a large crowd. I've still got a long way to go before I can consider myself to be Elias equal. You're great! I love you, Rishia! Hmm. And we get out of here. Oh, shoot. Hold on, we go anywhere else? It's already nighttime. Kia's still waiting for us. So let's head so let's head straight home. Okay. Nope, no, no, no Harold today. No hay words today. You guys looking, you guys look like a bunch of cool cats. Nice, 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 nice. You guys are gonna make the chicks at our shop real happy if you come in, if you come on in. Don't be shy now. Set right in. Ha ha ha. Wait, so you, you, okay, you work there. Hey, why not come hang out with me? You're missing out. I know how to make you happy. <laughs> There's no chicks here! There's only one girl! Well, I guess I'll start off with a drink. As I say, I is young. <laughs> Man, the president sure is taking his sweet, sweet time. Even after I order to pay for all of the service. The president the president of that one trading company was supposed to come today. Hmm. What do you guys want? I'm kinda in the middle of something, okay? Eric told me to just suck it up and get the job over with. Uh he's been acting so cool to me lately. Eric's always an asshole. We'll get to guarantee. Our stage will be open at 8 p.m. Feel free to sit back, relax, and maybe enjoy a drink until then. Oh. Come, come in and have a relaxing time. It's being nice right now. Tee hee, I'm Iris. I'm Iris. Hey there, sir. Do you want to hang out with a girl like me? Uh oh, do not do that! Ellie! Calm down, Ellie! Oh god, don't do that. Ellie's right there. What is that, Lloyd? Are you having fun with somebody else? You will be coming home tonight, right, Lloyd? Um, yeah, I suppose so. Suppose so? What does that mean, Lloyd? 
Are you not coming home right now, Lloyd? Are you not gonna... Are you done for the night, Lloyd? I thought you were done for the night. Ch -ch uh, I'm sorry, man. I, I think I have to go. <laughs> oh, shit. I've always got time for you. I'm feeling extra motivated today. <laughs> I'm going to spend all my time really in more customers. Ravager's building is up ahead. Let's stay away for, let's stay away for now. You wouldn't want to provoke them. Uh huh. I always expect Ren here. No, these chickens are good. From Jack in the Box, they're good. McDonald's still holds it up, but this is I think this is second place for chicken nuggets. My oh my, someone's tired. <laughs> In the spinning mood, dears. Look here, hold this urn for a short while, and you'll experience happiness. Happiness, energy, and the most wonderful of feeling. Of feelings. No thanks, ma'am. I appreciate if you wouldn't try to sell us sketchy stuff like your uh, magic urn. You really are a pro at taking advantage of people, eh? We're open until quite late today. <laughs> if you're looking for something in particular, I'm sure I could nudge you in the right direction. What would you sell anyways? That expensive as fuck! A city mission! A huge stuff machine installed with an alarm clock. Decoration for Teal's room. I want that. 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 Should we get it? Fuck it, let's get it. <laughs> oh, the night theme. lose weight then you gotta do some exercise so like you better start jogging tomorrow then sweetie hmm. what I don't want to go on runs by myself come on let's do it together I'm sure that'd be make I'm sure that make me work harder hmm. oh where did it get so late with how dangerous it's got to make me I better hurry on home Why well, you gotta have the chicken nuggets? I feel too much. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oops. I'm sorry we passed time to close up shop. If you want, you can have all the all the leftover balloons. I don't want them. Oh no, I'm totally late. Even though I was shopping for dinner, I'm still going to get chewed out at home. Hmm. It's already night. Kia should be waiting for us at, back at the annex. Come on, no detours. Good idea. Besides, we already finished all our required work for the day. Hmm. It's already night. Kios should be waiting for us back at the annex. Come on, no detours. Good idea. Besides, okay. Wait, what? So we can't go anywhere? Yep. What? Not even here? Nope. Like, go see Tia already, damn it! No Tia. Go see um, Kia! Alright, let's go. Oh. Look at her. She was waiting for us. Nobody says what that happens to her. <laughs> I 
Sandwich left. Hmm. Here we go. Oh my god, I got hiccups. Give me one sec. As full of energy as you always are, Kia. Yep, I'm always ready to roll. You're late. Was there a lot of work today? <laughs> More or less. Maybe we would have killed it. Maybe we would have killed over if we didn't have that nice car to drive around in. I second that. Hey, Tio. You look super tired. Are you alright? Oh. Yes, I'll be fine. After all, seeing your cute face has re-energized my batteries, Kia. Hmm. Aww. K -k -k Kia? Since I'm so full of energy, I don't mind sharing some. F I don't mind sharing some with you. Oh. Kia, share some with me as well. I'm tired too. Come, Kia. I would like to have your full of energy as well. You know what? <clears throat> I am feeling a little tired, Kia. You know, <laughs> you know, you can. <laughs> yeah, give me, you know, some, you know, some, give me some energy too. You know what I'm saying? But I think I deserve a lot more though, because you know, I, I, I do a lot. You know. <laughs> Anyways. So I'm full, since I'm so full of energy, I don't mind sharing some with you. <laughs> uh, yeah, um, I, 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 snuggles. Yeah, I, I kind of deserve that too right now. I kind of need the snuggles too. It, 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 it'll boost me back up to my, um, you know, my my full potential. That's cure for you. <laughs> Never seen medicine that potent. <laughs> Perhaps Kia hugs is stronger than a wonderful than a wonder drug. Thank you, Kia. I think I'm sufficient. I think I'm sufficiently recharged. I need it. <laughs> I'm glad. Come to think of it, is the chief not home yet, Kia? Chief? Oh, he's over in his office. A visitor came by, and he's still talking with him. Who's it? Who is it? A visitor? That's pretty rare, considering the time. Do you remember what he looked like? Hmm, he's an old man with a big beard. He kind of reminds me of a bear. Who? I think the chief called him something like a lawyer. Who? Oh, Mr. Grimwood. Oh, Mr. Groom was here. Why is he stopping by so late? Shall we go greet him while we have the opportunity? I will leave all that to you. I'm on kitchen duty tonight. You alright with cooking for everyone? If you want, I could take over for you tonight. No, I already made preparations for dinner earlier. It, sh it should be almost ready. Oh, Tio's dinner! Kia. Hold on just for a hold on just okay, hold on for just a little while longer, okay? Oh, Tio, Tio! Can I help you get the food ready? I knew it! You want to? Well then, 
You'll be my you'll be my sauce chef. Oh, I love this. This guy's napping without care in the world. Well, at this point, I'm not too surprised. Mr. Greenwood came to meet with the chief. Mr. Greenwood came to meet with the chief. Might as well say hello. Okay. Sorry, please wait a moment. I'll get everything up and running. Uh, wait. You don't need to be in such a rush, Tio. Well, I'll help out later. Very well. I'll be counting on you all. Tio! Helping, helping! Lloyd, dinner should be dinner should be ready in just a little bit, I think. With Tio, I mean, with, 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 with Kia, days will be ready. The orbit is shut down. No reason to use it now, anyway. Here we go. Excuse us. Hey. Hey. What took so long? Oh, sorry to be intruded when it's so late. So it was Mr. Greenwood after all. It's not every day you decide to visit us. Yes, well, I have some matters to discuss with Sergey. Why are you showing the whole picture of him? <laughs> Most likely, since I was in the neighborhood, I took the opportunity to stop by. Matters to discuss? Yeah. I'll cut to the heart of it. It's about Kia's identity. What? Uh oh. Then did you. You guys figure anything out? You guys figure anything out? Unfortunately not. Ah. It seems the request was also submitted to the guild. But I. At Sergei's behest, explored another possibility. Unfortunately, it wasn't. No, actually. I'm pleased to say the possibility I looked into was a bust. You're happy it was a bust? Right. It was... It was pertaining to a story several years back. There were multiple cases of a child abduction, primarily being focused in Cal Republic. Ah! Damn it! Child abductions? How horrible. I'll admit them more. I'll admit them more. Unnecessary details. But it was a pretty massive scandal. Because Calvert wasn't the only country targeted. An international investigation team was created to get to the bottom of things. Each country's army, police forces, the Bracer Guild, you name it. Everyone cooperated to put an end to that mess. To the mess. That's crazy. It's the first I've heard of it. Same here. Since it was kept under wraps, it must have been pretty damn serious. Yes, eventually the case was closed. Due to its nature in the end, the case was treated as strictly confidential. Only reason I know about it is because I was involved, serving as an advisor. Please hold on a second. You're saying that there's a chance Kia could be one of the victims from this whole abduction incident? I thought the same thing, so I searched through the case records again. To my relief, I was unable to find any children who matched Kia's description. For the record, the men responsible for those horrors were, were, were almost all arrested, and the, rest, and the rest committed suicide. Today, I simply came to inform Sergei of my, of my findings. I see. It gets darker and darker, huh? I believe that Kia wasn't a part of that, but the fact that it actually happened. I would have ended up telling you all about. I would have ended up telling you about all this eventually. Anyway, we're back to square one with Kia. Well, no skin of our back, right? Just gotta keep looking after the kiddo until we find one of, one of her relatives. Right. I appreciate it if you kept sheltering the child here. But in case we can end up, but in case we can't end up finding a relative, 
we should consider entrusting her to a foster family or to a church orphanage. No! Hold on. But, but, but. You all need to wrap your heads around those possibilities. Adopting a kid and properly raising them? That's not something you can jump into half-assed. No! No matter how adorable she may be. <laughs> Th that might be true. It's probably a hit. It's, it's probably a bit more difficult than taking a taking in a stray kitten or something. I'm sorry, everyone. Sounds like I brought down the mood of it. You all just returned from a long day of work, correct? I imagine you have a reboot to finish. I, mean, I imagine. Okay, I imagine you have a report to finish. So it's about time I excuse myself. No, please wait. The truth is. There's something we were planning on consulting you about. Oh? With me? Yes, actually. Lord explained the situation with the missing minor to Sergey and Mr. Grimwood. So you're working on a mission? So you're working on a missing person's case? <laughs> Sounds like a job for the SSS, alright. It didn't seem like anything illegal was going on, so we just let him how he was. I wonder if we should have tried a little harder to get him to go home. Hmm. Well, that's a complicated question. If a bracer tried to, there's a possibility that he'd listen to reason, or at least negotiate one. If a police officer tried to pull that move, odds are that the whole situation would turn into a giant fiasco. It's an exceedingly, it's an exceedingly fine line. I was afraid he'd say that. The guy's old enough to make his own decisions, so fortunately, it's none of our business. If he were just some brat, we could have we could have given him a spanking and taken him home. <laughs> That's true. However, you mentioned he gained gambling, gambling skill, luck. However, you mentioned he gained gambling skill, luck, intuition, like he was a different man. So about this rub you the wrong way? Well, it might just be a coincidence, but lately, two similar stories have come to my attention. Oh, I think I know what's going on. I know what's going on. No kidding? You're telling me there's not one, but three lucky bastards would hit the jackpot? I mean, you're telling me there's not one, but three lucky bastards who hit the jackpot? No, no, it's a bit different. The stories I heard, the stories I heard about involved a stockbroker who works for a security firm, for a securities firm, and the manager of a trading company. Recently, both companies sustained heavy losses and were almost in the red. But in the last, in the last few days, they seem to have experienced an incredible rebound. I could hardly believe it until I saw the numbers. Especially, the, especially that stockbroker. The story goes that he bought and sold stocks with unprecedented, with unprecedented luck and intuition, as if he could see the future. What? That's... Sounds pretty familiar. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm sure it's only coincidence. From what I've heard, their attitudes have changed in addition in their, to their skills. They supposedly become extremely arrogant. That tidbit piqued my interest. That's definitely strange. Hey, I am. Any chance you know the backgrounds of these two? Uh, not yet. If you're interested, I can start researching right away. You want to check possible ties, yes, I presume. Yes, if possible. Did they catch your attention, Chief? When you're in this business, Lloyd, it never hurts to have all the information you can. It's as simple as that. Uh, I understand. Guy told me something like that too. Ah, uh, I understand. Guy told me something like that too. That decisive factors is an investigation or intuition in the information you uncover. Well then, I'll get out of your way now. If, 
you ever have anything bothering you, don't hesitate to stop by my office. I'll do everything in my power to help out. Thank you very much, Mr. Grimwood. When the time comes, we'll, we'll come knocking. Hmm. What's going on? What's going on? Oh, meanwhile, to eat my burger, my chicken sandwich. Oh, God, I got mayonnaise. Give me a sec. All right. Anyways, let me put the check real quick over here. Alright. Ravage managed to recover their smuggling routes? Yes, sir. Three, three of the routes were decimated over the last week and have already been re reorganized. We've been trying to impede them. Whether resilience was more unexpected. Hmm. How curious. I would like to believe that they didn't have the manpower to accomplish such a thing. Did the boss finally involve himself in, in their restoration efforts? That's the, strangest, that's the strangest part. The killing bear was nowhere to be found. This appeared to be solely be the work of, the, of subordinates. The reports state that they don't. They, the reports state that they only brought enough for a small army. Not only that, for there were no warhounds present either. How interesting! Now I'm even more curious. Had this if, has this been a battle of numbers? Kiyue should have come out victorious. Did they employ those Rainford heavy machine guns, perhaps? Yes, actually. The main, the main forces appear to have been armed with them. However, the report also mentions that their battle powers, prowess has skyrocketed. Interesting. I get the impression Don Markini is trying his damnedest to appease the speaker and quell his rage. I don't recall any new reports of Jaegers being employed uh, or any training exercises being held either. Very peculiar indeed. Are you implying that they've acquired a trump card right under our noses? Precisely. When comparing our respective trump cards, I get the feeling that theirs is extraordinary. Much like Master Yin, I believe that there's a wild card. One that can turn the ties of battle at a moment's notice. Damn them. What in the world is it then? Oh no! What was that? Oh yes, speak of the devil. He shall come. We got a big problem on our hands. A group of men draped in black are unloading rounds into the buildings. Ravage, I think. There's about ten of them. And the killing bear isn't one of them. There are only ten measly grunts? Hurry up and finish them off then. And don't worry about the police. This is self-defense, so anything goes. Well, well, the thing is, those guys aren't human, I'm telling you. They're holding massive machine guns with just one hand. What? The first floor has been breached. It's only a matter of time before they reach us, sir. Damn it. If only Master Yin was here. Oh, dear. I don't think I'll be able to outwit them in a barbaric situation like this. Master Chow, you don't mean... Master Chow, you don't mean... We're leaving, Lao. Relying on Yin for a petty squabble like this will be a stain on the U.S. name. Come, let us demonstrate our might as the conquerors of the Eastern Quarter. What? What's going on? And it's the next day. <laughs> What happened? You can't do that.
Hey, hey! No cheating. Alright. It's good for the surprises. Yeah, what the fuck? Even us with the cliffhanger, yep. You're telling me that Kia cooked all of these sunny side up eggs for us? She sure did. Her technique was so good that I found myself taking mental notes while watching. Fried eggs with a bit of run running yo, nice. Get a load of this bacon. Get a load of this bacon too. It's like perfectly crisp. She does seem to have quite the knack for the culinary arts. Yesterday's, yesterday's cream soup was basically her own creation. Are you sure you haven't had any prior cooking experience, Kia? I don't know. Maybe. Whenever I cook, it's like my hands are moving on their own. It's like my hands are moving on their own. Well, I guess it's true that cooking is more through personal experience than anything else, but the fact that she, the fact that she's this talented at her age is pretty amazing. Hey, Teal, I was wondering, do you feel okay today? Uh, you look fine, as far as I can tell. But don't you think, but don't you think it'd be better to take the day off and rest? No, I'm fine. After all. I went to bed quite a bit earlier than usual yesterday. Hmm. You can if need be. I don't think we have any urgent requests to take care of, so we can always wait and see how you're feeling. A call? Pretty early, pretty early for that, ain't it? Is a friend? I'll check. Hello, this is Lloyd Bennings. Hello, this is Lloyd Bennings of the Spurs Support. Yeah, yeah, I know already. Now, where the heck are you? What are you doing right now? Oh. What are you doing right now? Yeah, yeah, I know already. Yeah, yeah, I know already. Now, where the heck are you? What are you doing right now? Jonah? Wow, I wasn't expecting a night owl like yourselves to be awake this early in the morning. Ha! <laughs> I'm glad I didn't pull an all-nighter. What about that? It doesn't matter. From how carefree you sound, I bet you don't know anything at all, right? Don't know what exactly? So you don't know? Well then, I, the great and brilliant Jonah, will do you a favor. In dead of night yesterday, well, totally today, I guess. But that's, bes but that's beside the point. Either way, the U.S. office building was raided by someone. What? They're cockabilly off guard. Too. No offense. All defense, you know. Apparently, they took some serious damage. If you ask me, it have it have to have it had to have been done by those ravish guys. It's not outside of the realm of possibility. Think for the heads up, Jonah. <laughs> you owe me one, Lloyd. That was Jonah? Yeah, something crazy has popped up. Lord relayed the information he heard from Jonah to the rest of the special support section. I is that really true, Lloyd? That's freaking insane. It's, it's bold to pull off such a thing in the city, even if it was in the middle of the night. What? Interesting development. If true. I bet anything that the first division has already jumped on the case. If it bothers you that much, go check it out. Only after you finish eating. Will do, sir. Oh right. Would you be good to go to you? Yes, of course. We can walk over to the Harbor District after we finish our breakfast. And it's finished. Kia is in the kitchen, cleaning up after breakfast. If 
figure if you figure something out, you better tell me, okay? <laughs> we'll do, Kia. Cleaning, cleaning. If you figure if you figure out something, you better tell me, okay? Sergey's cleaning up the kitchen after breakfast. With the mafia's involved, we should fall to the first division. You can't ignore a case this big. I'll head to the department to ask them about it, just in case. That's all I got. Dismissed. I'll head to the police department later and ask them about it. Hmm. Alright, as always, there's no doubt that he's one of us. The vigilant protector of the fair support section. Agree. Imagine he will eviscerate, eviscerate any suspicious characters that dare enter. Mm hmm. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I knew it. Should be fine. Look at that. This should be fine. A new decoration was added to Tio's room. It's a sitting machine. <laughs> and this is Kia's room, most likely. Or not. She'd rather sleep with Lloyd. Guys, the news to say. I know they do. You heard of that attack at, at, at the Ar Pearl Harbor, or whatever. Oh, come on! Before you start bothering me, do you really need to buy something? Cause I'm not in the mood. You could take a look around, but then you gotta scrap. Still different to potential buyers. Yeah, well, what's new? You're really, you're really that interested in what we, what I've got? Look around. And then leave me alone. And then leave me alone. All right. Leave me alone. That's been really strict today. But I know he loves me, so I'll listen to him. Ever heard about the accident over at the harbor? Over in the harbor district yet? I'm gonna have to keep a close eye on my daughter for the time being. Hold on. Let's see. Oh, just that one. Creative Coast one and long. So I guess we're gonna talk today. And hopefully do a little bit of story. Let me finish my chicken sandwich, though. Mm, 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 mm. Alright, Pashi? Is it Jirimishi? It is. It's good. I have a chicken addiction. Oh, not yet. Mm. Yeah, it's not cold. It's a little warm, but not cold. I'm 
almost done. Okay. I heard rumors that the local mafias are butting heads. I have a bad feeling about this. Whatever that happened in the past, as would roll. I was under the impression Crossbow had become re relatively peaceful. But I guess I can't hold my breath just yet. I have heard rumors that the local mafias are butting heads. Whenever I hold balloons, all my worries seem to float away. Look here, see how silly this one is? Even when you feel down, even when you feel down, my balloons are sure to bring your laughter back. Hmm. Where's it supposed to go, anyways? Let's go to Harbor District and see what else is for ourselves. We're gonna probably go everywhere else before the harbor. So we're gonna go this way now. From the We're gonna do a circle. We're gonna go to um the administrative district district, the administrative district, and then to the entertainment district. And then we go to the residential district over here. And then this side over here, and then back over here, and I go around in there, and I'm talking, and I go back to Harvard. All right. Anyways, okay, just saying the same thing. Ah, how I love snacks. Finding a bunch of, finding a bunch, and immediately tearing into them is the pinnacle of life. Hey, what's with that nasty look? Eat, eat something sour? Hmm. Uh, it's just not fair. Why would you show off such tasty food while I'm in, in the middle of diet? Please, just let me have a tiny bit. It'll be my reward for this morning's run. in the harbor district was a bit overwhelming honestly something about it was creepy especially considering the police showed up hmm something's up in the harbor district I just hope no one got hurt hmm I was finally able to experience an arc and social yesterday and it was amazing. I'm definitely going to pick up the fan book I saw. Hmm. The chief keeps on peeking out of the kitchen for some reason. He even waved at me when when our eyes locked. What's this deal? The chef, that's a chef. That's a chief. So many police officers today. They've been patrolling the city since morning, I think. Oh shoot. Uh, oh, of course. I can't find my tissue. I can't, okay, I can't find my tissue. I can't find my issue of the crossbow times. I must have left it at home before I heading out. My blood pressure spikes whenever I think about how the diet meeting went. Hmm. 
here. Satel likes to leave the kitchen occasionally during his shifts. Most of the time, his present is to present the dishes he makes directly to, to the customers. Does he not understand that we have a waitress for that? Do your job, sir. Oh no, what do I do? The magic and, br and brown won't help me. What in the world do I do? Excuse me, we received a request from an employee here named Satel. Do you know him by any chance? You came to help me? Oh, thank you, thank you. You're the, um, special support section. Pleasure to make your acquaintance. I'd love to help you, if you have us. Yep, the cousin was always right. We're always here to help. I get the feeling I'm be I get the feeling I'm becoming some sort of an errand boy. I mean, we're always here to help. I get the feeling I'm becoming some sort of errand boy. So your quest, it involves searching for something, right? Yes, that's right. Save me, man. You see, I was told by the manager to try and come up with a new dish for the restaurant. But yeah, it's not going well. I've reached my creative... I've reached my creative limit. It's useless. It's all useless. Well, that kind of thing happens to everyone. Even if you're a pro chef, it's not that easy to always be coming up with new stuff, I guess. Basically, having to cook for celebrities from time to time doesn't make it any easier. So that's why I need you to help me. I heard that I heard that your division mingles with the public a lot. I thought that you might have been to your fair share of restaurants. I'm looking for dishes that are truly unique. Entries that you sometimes make when thinking outside the box. As in peculiar dishes. Kind of like when you set out to cook an almond rice, but, when, but wind up with something completely different. Is that what you mean? Exactly! It's the very essence of cuisine. There's a fine line between failure and success. That, my friends, is where, is where new ideas wait for us. So, you guys cook too? That's perfect! Now my expectations are sky high! I don't think... I don't think anything we make is fit for a professional chef, personally. Anyway, I think we understand your issue now. We just need to bring your peculiar dishes we've made, right? Yep, that'd be great. I want to compare all of them, so I need at least 10. But I mean, the more the merrier. Cook as many, cook as many you can. That about wraps it up, I think. My taste buds and I will be waiting. Quest Creative Cooks want it started. Hey, don't you think the girls sitting in the in those center in those center seats are pretty cute? I sure do. I think I'll give them some of my prototype dishes on the house. Behold, an original recipe made with you specifically in mind. With a line like that, any one of them is as good as mine. And besides, chatting with a pretty girl and hearing some constructive criticism on my recipes is killing two birds with one stone. People keep saying that there was a big accident in, in the Hobbit district this morning. Oh well, we should be far up. We should, we should be far enough away that it doesn't affect customers' traffic. The sudden spike in, in the accidents is problematic for us, to say the least. At this rate, people are going to want to go out for a meal. If these accidents stop, if these accidents don't stop, we're going to have quite the dilemma on our hands. over here now. Let's see. Woody's recently started to, to compliment me on how I set up the displays. 
It's not like I need her approval or anything, though. Hmm. Formers are truly amazing. They made our lives much more convenient. Whoever first invented them must have been a great man. Chaco told me yesterday how I don't need to watch over her and all that, but... Isn't it natural for, for a father to be worried about how his only daughter is doing at work? <laughs> this just means I have to be even sneakier so she doesn't catch me. I'm not here. I'm just a normal shopper. Uh -huh. hmm. Chaco seems to be working hard. Papa's proud of you, baby. Wow. Ha 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 ha. Dad's still trying to check on me, even after everything I said yesterday. I'm going to have to start ignoring him completely until he stops. Wow. I used to not think highly of Orbal stores, but they've grown on me. The equipment is really well maintained, so it makes servicing much easier. Customers also visit more frequently compared to the old workshop. I guess prese presentation matters a lot, doesn't it? There was one customer who stopped me in the in the street a while ago to thank me for my repair work. Stuff like that is why I'm glad. Stuff like that is why I'm glad to come into work in the morning. Welcome to Titan's department store. We host all kinds of events and sales and to satisfy our customers. Break, our, break out a smile and charm every customer. That's our manager's motto. Hmm. I can tell from the manager's expression that he's giddy. He reminds me of a child that, he, he, that has a new toy to play with. His face always perks up like that when he thinks up a new project. I'm more looking forward to it. Hmm. No, 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 no. My daughter's juice stall has been flourishing thanks to the nice weather we've been having. She doesn't go one day without boost boasting about how business is booming. I could be prouder of her. To be honest, to be honest. After all, the daughter's happiness is her mother's happiness. My daughter wanted to run her own business, so she opened a juice stall. I can't help but feel that she's in her element while she runs it. My parents made me take care of the shopping again, but I always feel like a kid in a, in a candy store here. I really gotta get my hands on that reference book I found here the other day. You think it's worth it? You think it's worth it to beg my parents to give me a to give me the mirror? Hmm. I was struck by inspiration for a new sales strategy when I woke up this morning. You never know when or when or where the next spark of inspiration will come. You can't just pick up. You can't. You, get, you can't just pick what to what to put in the, on the display in the display case willy nilly. If you haven't thought long and hard about what ha what appeals to customers, then you've already lost the battle. The Munos? Nope, we already got that. Already got all that. Dad's getting paid, so you know what that means, right? Mom's going to go on a non-stop shopping spree again. 
poor kid. Like, damn, is this all I'm good for? It's time to it's time to shop until I drop. I'm going to buy whatever I want. Hmm. Poor kid. We have no shoe repairs here. I should I should mention that it can become costly repair older shoes, depending on how difficult it is to gather the correct materials. Our service is a hit with people hoping to cling on to their trusty partners for a little bit longer. My father, okay. My alarm clock stopped working all of a sudden. Yeah, I'm so, I'm still so sleepy. Hmm. Did the mafia manage to finally push their luck? Doesn't matter if they're the almighty ravage. I don't think they'd be able to kick up a storm and wave, and wave it away. Guys has been coming here pretty regularly, but I haven't seen him since yesterday. He seems to be, he seems to be making a killing at the casino, but I'm sure his luck's run out by now. They're beautiful. There's an austere beauty to wear in an outfit perfectly tailored to your duties. I think the uniforms of Crossbow Police Department and the Guardian Force are highly st stylish. Hmm. Okay, now we don't talk to everybody in this in this place, the Central Plaza. There's any orbits we can make. We want slots. There's your orbits. Let's see. doesn't No slots. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ah. We're almost done with it. station. 
I'm grateful to the Empire for blessing the world with so many beautiful trains. It's just, I can't forgive them for developing those railway guns. You can say that trains transport people as well as the dreams of, of train fans like me. Trains like the Empire's railway guns, even if they're on rails. Railways aren't meant to be instruments of war. They're noble creations meant for transporting people, freight, and dreams. Yeah. If I, if I had fallen in love with a woman of the same social class, my dear wouldn't have had cuts ties with her family. I'm the worst, aren't I? Still, when I see her radiant smile, my fears and guilt are washed away by her love. Aww. My beloved and I have escaped the Empire, far from my father's reach. We can finally live our lives without worry. But what? Reheat? Oh, already ate already. Do you still double my burger? Isn't that, it's a never ending cycle. Here I am again, waiting for more packages. The sad thing is, I think I'm actually getting used to all these late arrivals. Well, I suppose being able to savor the wait is the mark of a pro, right? I just like the Empire's railway guns. Even if they're on, even if they're on. Okay, we're talking. Never mind. We don't have time to leave the city now. Oh! We already have our hands full with the Hayes case, so let's deal with that first. Really now? We can't leave the city. We can't leave the city. I'm not sure why, but the latest issue of the Crossbow Times was postponed. I've been to a few stores that carry their publications, but none of them have the latest one. So what the hold up? I demand a proper explanation! Hmm. It's inconceivable for the Crossbow Times to delay a publication. Do you not hear what happened? I guess worse than the other auto. Where's my news? We're having some lovely weather, aren't we? We're having some lovely weather, aren't we? Weather like weather like today's my savings grace. Considering I can stay open on a rainy day. I anticipate people will be crawling to me for refresh refreshments. Considering how warm it is. Juice. The die has been the die has been added all morning trying to decide on the budget. Too bad it's a diet in, in the name only. It's nothing more than the futile shouting match between the Imperial and the Republican faction. <sighs> Mary McDowell is a glorified babysitter at this point. I, I would see the hall today, if I were you. All you'll find are Imperial and Republican factions. Hardly insults at each other. What? Speaker Hartman is supposed to be the mediator, yet he supports the Imperial faction. Mayor McDowell must have it rough. Hmm. Library. Thanks, Lloyd. As you might imagine, we're far too understaffed to handle this task on our own. I'll contact you if there are anything. If there are any updates, what? The, sh the shootout wasn't really in the park, was it? 
how could this have happened? That area is meant for business. Think about it all morning. Thinking about it all morning has put me in a bad mood. He says something we, we read before, and then he says something different after. I got my hands on some pretty interesting documents today. This here is the Mimior, Mimior of the Traders Exploits from 80 years ago. This is definitely a valuable relic that'll help cont context contextualize Crossbow's past. I, wanna, I, I said that wrong, I'm sorry. If you think about it, Crossbow hadn't even been established as an autonomous state 80 years ago. The region suffered from instability, which caused traders to suffer. Hmm. Boy, the weather is wonderful today. Sounds like the perfect time to air the dust out of these books. Well, they're not too terribly dirty. I've, I've seen worse. A light airing should do the trick. Hmm. You said? This weather is making me want to go out on a picnic, to be honest. I think I'll go out on a stroll and get some fresh air during my break. The officer ran, ran, ran with all of their might. Yet, the piggy still got away. What? Whoa! Police officers, police officers are cool! <laughs> Kid. Alright, here we go. Oh, you're all here. The first division is working their hardest, investigating the, the raid in, on the U.S. office. They've all been out there the whole morning. Oh, I see. Wow, they're really on the ball. I don't think anyone's out doing the first division on this kind of investigation anytime soon. The first division is working their hardest. They had an early morning meeting this to, to discuss the investigation. They've all gone out to investigate. I hope that SS can one day reach the first division's level on diligence. Hmm. Oh, everyone! Looks to me like you've been hard, you've been hard at work filling out your comic notebook. I'd like to record your information into our database. What if I see it for a minute? With pleasure. Thank you very much. Here's your notebook back. Let me gather your compensation. Please accept this. Receive 500 mirror. Receive your material times one. Don't forget to stop by once you collect the more monster data, okay? Right. Leave it to us. Of course. We'll see to it that we visit. Hmm. Hey, friend. Whoa. A gunfight? What the heck is going on out there? Oh my god. Whoa, a gunfight? What the is going on out there? How does something so dangerous happen in the middle of the city? I believe friend only recently became privy to the details of the incident. Yeah, I doubt any information is going to leak with how tight-lived the first division is. How does something so dangerous happen? That really grinds my gears. Wawa! <laughs> we don't have any business upstairs. And I think we'd all rather not get chewed out by the deputy director. So let's not risk it. A raid? Are they insane? We're blessed to have come out of it without any casualties. It'd be nice if we could arrest those dirtbags immediately too. It's obvious that Ravage did it. But we have to gather adequate evidence before we can actually issue a warrant for the arrest. The Metropolitan Division has already launched an investigation to start the process. Hmm. Alright. 
Crossbow, crossbow. All right, here we go. Some guy had an insane stroke of luck at the casino, and now they say he's surrounded by riches and bitches. Whoa. And now they say he's surrounded by riches and bitches. I'm pretty damn jealous of him. I can't believe the level of success he's had. If only I were that lucky. <laughs> Please come out and bestow upon us your magnificent wave, Lady Leah. I think Arkin saw hire a new assistant sometime recently. I get the impression that she's pretty unfriendly, given that she usually glares at me. <laughs> that was silly. That one girl was glaring at me while I was watching Lady Leah this morning. Why did Trump go and hire such an unfriendly weir weirdo? <laughs> too sorry. Why too? Some of our Arcan Cell told me something interesting. It said one of their members has been acting like a weirdo recently. What's up with them? But well, maybe he has an upset stomach. I say that eating ice cream with an upset stomach is a bad idea. I say that eating ice cream with an upset stomach is a bad idea. Yep, finally. Okay, never mind. This district feels like it's been caught up in this sticky situation. It smells like the fish in the air. The cows, the cows are about to raise someone. I figured it. I figured I should get the hell out of here earlier than usual. Yep, today's definitely a weird one. I don't even feel like reeling in more customers. Speaker Hartman is definitely a corrupt sleaze ball. Not only is he demanding hit to his staff, he also has connections to Ravage. <laughs> What an utterly frightening man. I'd be shaking in my boots if I had to go up against him. S Speaker Hartman's main opponent is Representative Campbell, for now. I struggle to imagine anyone being able to overpower Speaker Hartman for long. Hmm. Oh, really? Another day, another chaotic type meeting. How will they ever face the citizens of Crossbow if they keep this up? Their terrible, their terrible attitudes causes causes them to bait each other, to bait each other into screaming matches every 30 seconds. You're gonna pay me to sit there and watch that. It pays me to see our diet in such a sorry state. Okay. How would they ever face the citizens of, of Crossbow if they keep this up? Hmm. Members of the staff are working hard to prepare for the Q&A session following the following the diet meetings adjournment. There's not a moment of rest for them. But there's not a moment of rest of, for any of them. Our department has plenty of free time because of all we do is maintain equipment. Maintain the equipment. I feel a little bad for them, I really do. The least I can do for them is clean the quarters one more time. Hmm. Global State Government City Hall, Administrative District. We have no reason to go inside here. No one's here. Let's go back to the entertainment district. Hmm. Hi, how are you doing? The the Frogger Casino is here to provide you with the best service. I just saw you guys last night. <laughs> I 
Hey Randy, the owner's over in the special room if you need him. He's been watching all of Gant's matches all morning. Oh, you mean that one room reserved for the VIPs? Yep, Gant's in the middle of a match with some, with some other guy right now. It's pretty crazy, isn't it? He used to be some casual amateur, but now he gets the full VIP treatment. Gaz is currently in the middle of a heated match with another customer. Simon decided to rise to the occasion after Gelletti and Elinde were no longer able to compete. Hmm. Hmm. That man plays recklessly. I would quit while I'm ahead if I was him. Yeah, he's about to lose everything. Moron tried to challenge Gans to a match. I give him a warning, but he failed to listen. Hmm. I went to observe the situation over in the VIP room moments ago. It's just as disappointing as I, I was expecting. Gans' opponent is getting totally murdered. Man, I guess he did tie Gans once out of their five matches. It's looking like Gaz is going to make a ton of money again. I feel kind of sorry for his opponent, to be honest. There, Myron is doing well. I hear, I heard Gaz was making a fortune in the VIP room. The Taurus is playing against Gaz. Hmm? Oh well, is this is their funeral? I'm getting old. Am I getting old? Or has Gaz gotten freaking good? Nobody can beat the guy anymore. Hmm. All right. Now we go to the to the hotel. Gans left the hotel looking like he was in a good mood today. I could have sworn someone from the mains was coming to pick him up. Wouldn't it have made more sense for him to wait in his room? Hmm. Okay, I need to check up on our Orbo Network reservation. I have to admit that I started having fun once I figured out how to use that complicated machine. Hmm. No one's here. Of course no one's here. I received an enormous tip from Gantz. I felt uncomfortable holding that much money, so I went and donated it to the city hall. To city hall. I don't know what they plan on using it for, but it's better than keeping it keeping it to myself. I received enormous tips from Gantz. I feel bad about it, so I donated it to City Hall. Maybe I should have kept it a little bit. Nah, you did good. No one here. No one here. Gantz is currently renting a Lux Suite under a long-term contract. He may be completely selfish. But it's okay. A, a professional like myself knows how to handle this type. To handle his type. Hmm. So he's been an asshole to everybody. Let's go here. An, an artist by the name Nicole works for us. I've noticed he's been training as hard as he can these days. I must say. His enthusiasm is impressive. He put an all-nighter just to practice. What? That's horrible. I'm surprised how passionate artists like Risha or Aaliyah can be. The rest of us staff members better step it up. I must try to, I must try to have Soli give the stage a shot. She 
She's only an assistant at the moment, but that's about to change. She's been studying Elias' every move during practice. That kid's going to be a star in the future. Hmm. Sully is, atten is, in is intently watching Elias practice. Her sense, so her sense for, for okay, her sense for the performing arts are top notch. She's going to be big. Hmm. I think I think the staircase leads to the second floor seats. We just end up being a nuisance if we stick around too long. But it's not. Huh? Huh? I have a bad feeling about this. Hmm. Nicole was partaking in some rather ostentatious acrobatics yesterday. Has he always been such a peacock? Hmm. Hey, please, doesn't Nicole seem a little bit different lately? Oh, you noticed it too. I've been putting, I've been getting some weird advice from him. It's as if he's co a complete different person. Again? Excuse me, is everything okay? Oh, the police officer have, have arrived. This isn't serious. We were just co co conversing about Nicole. Right, apparently. Nicole's been engaged in some special training lately. A spin off, too. The technique and strength have improved considerably. The strange thing is, his personality seems to have changed as a result. Huh? You think his personality is gone haywire? Well, I suppose it's possible. How often do people completely change overnight though? I wonder about that. I think people can change as long as they, uh, they are motivated to do so however. I'm sure Nickel must have had a life-changing experience like that. You know, I do seem to remember him disappearing for a while after the festival ended. It's entirely possible that something may have happened then. That may be true, but he hardly ever says anything to us. Apparently, Nico has been engaged in some special training. I could tell his stamina has improved considerably. It's a remarkable idea, honestly, though. It's a remarkable idea, honestly. Although, I feel as as if he's as if his personality has changed. I'm a little bit worried. He doesn't seem he doesn't seem like his usual self anymore. <laughs> Another perfect rehearsal. I feel like I'm in perfect form. I feel like I could even take Rishia down. Fuck you. Everybody watching me was shocked. <laughs> I can't get enough of this feeling. Serves all you naysayers, right? Nicole's attitude has changed drastically in such a short amount of time. Is this what gaining confidence does to a person? No. Nicole's been in perfect form these days. I can't believe how well he performed during today's rehearsal. C crap, first Rushia, and now Nicole? Everyone's just leaving me in the dust these days. First Nick, first Rishia, and now Nicole? I'm going to be left behind if I don't start trying harder. Just last night, Nicole was operating the stage controls on his own. So like he's so like he pulled all, another all-nighter so he could practice. 
It's funny that he's putting his heart and soul into it, but isn't this going a bit overboard? Will Nico ever take a break? Pretty sure he's been exerting himself a bit too much these days. Hmm. So this is going on. Oh, there she is. I don't think I can pull off that kind of action. If we're going to add a scene, it should be something that's going to win over our dear audience's hearts. Be that as it may, I don't want the, I don't want the play to get sidetracked. Dude. I understand where you're coming from, but could you think about it some more? Not a chance. <laughs> I thought you might say that. I believe they're holding a discussion regarding the play. And the trump leader is distressed. I think we better leave them alone. Oh yeah, about our earlier conversation. You mean the one about Nickel? He was definitely being a weirdo. But I do think that his role in the play But I do think that his role in the play in the play is a tad unbalanced. Oh I know. Why don't we add a fight scene between him and Theodore? <laughs> Come with some slack, will you? Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it for Entertainment District. Now we're going to the uh, this side. We're going over here. Residential Street. Come on, old man. Representative Campbell has an intense uphill battle ahead of him. After all, the current power of the Imperial faction won't be shaking so easily. Hmm. Representative Campbell supposedly has his own plans in store for Diet. But considering his opponent is, is Speaker Hartman. Things are looking a little grim for him. The, the gate is locked. How, are we ever going to go in there one day? I don't think we are. This is the home of Representative Campo, the leader of the Republic faction. There's no reason to speak with him right now. This one, this is the, this is the sea's north exit. We already have our hands full with the, the U.S. case. So let's deal with that first. Well, we can't even go to the north side either. Hmm. What? What's wrong, Johanna? Nothing, my lady. It's just that a new edition of the Crossbow Times was released today, but it hasn't arrived yet. I better go ask about this later. I better go ask about this later. But the Imperial faction takes orders from the Empire. The, Republic, the Republican faction bends to the Republic's every win. It's as if the two major powers are playing a game of tug of war with Crossbow. The diet should wrap up soon at this rate. Hmm. No one here. No one here. Speaker Hartman is a st is a state representative, much like Master Henry. He should be working to unify the diet. However, 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 for him to sit silently in his chair and to allow the laxi laxity of the diet to continue as is, I can only imagine he continues to do this as a way to torment the master. I should never forgive that foul man. I've been in Master Henry's service for 40 years now. I find it difficult to forgive Speaker Hartman's attitude.
Early, where are those secret pictures of Lloyd? <laughs> Father. Hmm? What's wrong? It's nothing. It's just that, oh. Uh, for the last while, Father's been acting. <laughs> you goddamn morons. What, what's happened to Father? He seems really off to me for some reason. But Father must be exhausted from working all day. I'm sure that's why he's acting weird. I need to do something to cheer him up. Mother has a cooking class to attend today. I feel like she's always late, too late back. I need to get my act together. What a bunch of morons. The price of those stocks freaking take in three days. There's, they seriously couldn't see that coming. The, CN, the CNS Business Magazine is run by a circus of clouds. <laughs> Wait, aren't I totally awesome? Aren't I totally awesome? Well, whatever. It's all the same anyway. <laughs> what the fuck's going on? Hey, Joanna. Hey, Joanna. Joanna. All right. Jonah is stuffing his face with pizza. Mm. 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 So, how was Huey looking? Pretty nasty, I bet. Well, we were just about to go check it out. Come on, man. Not another time to be chilling here. Go! My customers don't like waiting for info, you know. So you're just planning to circulate the details after we work for them, eh? Jonah, think very carefully about your response. Uh, well... I just wanted to earn back a little Mira. Those information fees are killer. Come on, I'm just looking after my livelihood. Yep. This, this, boy does, this boy hasn't been disciplined once in his life, has he? Hey, I was surprised to hear something crazy like that too, you know. Since I accidentally spilled the beans, could we settle on an installment plan? Come on, don't need to look so angry. Jonah. <laughs> what was that? That was weird. Hmm. Why third? Let's see. Her crossbow diet has been repeating the exact same pattern for the last for the past seventy years. One, one year the Imperial Faction ri rises into power. The next year, the Republican Faction rinse and repeat. What a lot of baloney. It's only natural that we all lose interest in it. Most cross villains don't expect much from the diet anymore. That pitiful thing is so pointless that they may as well stop pulling from them. Alright, I think I'm going to get dressed and ask for Cindy's opinion on my threats. Once the budget meeting has, ad has adjourned, has adjourned there, are, there are going to be some huge parties. Some of the, some of the business world's biggest names, like the IBC CEO, Dyer Kroos, are going to be in attendance. Haha, <laughs> I'm trying to attend the same party as him. No! Once the budget meeting has adjourned, there are going to be some huge parties. This is my one chance to become chummy with some superstars. Ever not screw up. Hmm. 
Hey, where's residence? You know, I happened to pass by your husband yesterday, Creel. I feel like he's becoming... I feel like he's become a little strange these days. Almost as if he's become more disrespectful. Hmm. I haven't really thought about it. But now that you mention it... I suppose he might have started using the harsher language recently. Maybe? Uh, so has he... Or has he not? Krill is always so relaxed. How do I put this? Krill is a bit slow, I guess. It's not, really, it's not really a big deal, though. She's an adorable lady. Hmm. Huh, um. Hmm. I guess he has been acting a little strange lately. Should I be worried? How he does it. it looks absolutely d delectable. We have another one, Sophia. Mm, 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 mm. Sophia. I'm pretending I'm daddy when he's when he eats a lot of food. Wow. But. To see her gentle husband resorting to, hard, to such harsh words. I worry for the relationship. Who could have brought on such a change in demeanor? Alright. Hey, Wurz. Well, hey, um, Sophia. Since you're the only one here, I'm sorry for being such an ass. Um, you know, calling your best prayers, even though I was just being sarcastic. The whole time. And I'm sorry for always coming to this house and calling it a happy, happy, happy family, even though it's not really happy. So I wish you guys, I wish you guys well. Just know that your daughter is happy. How do you know that? Nothing. Forget it. All right, there, a show. All right. What was I doing in circle? This is the last part of the circle. Why are you so mean to me? Somebody told me that there are massive ruins somewhere around um, American Village. I already said sorry twice! It's a place I've been dying to visit since I've been focusing on taking landscape shots. I already did! There are apparently many unexplored ruins all over Crossbell. There's so much to miss out on. There's so much to miss out on if you only stick to the city. No, I said sorry twice! <laughs> the latest issue of the Crossbell Times was postponed? No way. My beloved breakfast companion. How am I going to know what... How am I going to know what ended up happening during the diet session? I don't even, I don't even remember the last time the crossbow times had to, be, had to be delayed. What in the world could have caused that? It was two! Us three are hanging out today. <laughs> Didn't you know? It's more fun to play in a larger group. Aww. Huh. It was actually worth it to play in the group of three. Alright, Momo. From now on, you're a part of the squad. Yes. Let's get playing together. Aww. Here, Momo. I'm going to pass it to you. Get ready to catch it, okay? I'm ready. Oh, Momo has friends. Let's see.
It was two. I said sorry twice. My husband has been working. Really, my husband has been working restlessly in the in the office since this morning. <laughs> he's been fix. He's been fixated on that building lately. Hmm. <laughs> I've got to head back home soon. <laughs> Momo recently made a new friend. They've been playing together lots. Hopefully this will hopefully this will force her out of her shell. I'm still optimistic, despite the constant bo bombardment of bad news concerning the incidents around the city. Despite the constant bombardment of bad news, my child's smiling face always brightens my day. I wish we returned to peaceful times. Hmm. I was taking a peek out on the wind earlier, and Mama was playing with a, with a friend. Mama is so proud of her. She's normally very shy. I think I'll cook some red rice tonight to celebrate. You finally done it, Momo. You brought joy to your mom and dad. We'll have to celebrate tonight. Aww. Yay, Momo! Congrats on Momo for making friends. Yay! Happy friendship, happy friendship, happy, happy, happy friendship. Anyways. Good morning. You, do you need to talk to Mr. Grimwood about something? He just started working on today's agenda. Morning cleaning is an important job for an assistant. Since Mr. Grimwood doesn't really care about it, it's up to me to do it for him. It's two! Oh? Up and at it early this morning, are you? Are we? Has something happened? If you need to discuss anything, feel free to take a seat. No, actually, sir. Feel free to take a seat. We have, we have reported that Huey Trading Company was raided by an unknown group of asylums. By Adios, is that true? Or well, I know where to go check it out. No, actually. Everything we've heard points to Ravage being our perps, though. An attack like that in the harbor? I can't understand what, what was going through their heads. Ravage, that is. I can, compre I can comprehend wanting to attack their main competitor. But something about this sounds sloppy. As if it wasn't planned. We were actually thinking the same thing. Nothing about this suggests nothing about this suggests the beginning of a full fledged war between the mafias. Hmm. Either way, we need to be cautious. Hmm. I have no doubt businesses are going to flock to the office once hear the news. Good luck, but tell me something useful. Thank you, sir. Honestly, I don't think we've ever stopped by without owing you another favor. Raiding a raiding competitor in such a populated area? Something about that doesn't sit right with me. Anyway, a lot of businesses will be feeling uneasy because of the situation. We still can't ignore the possibility of retaliation by Huyue. Be careful with all this, everyone. Hmm. <laughs> hey, what did I do? I bought bread from this bakery and made my mom and dad eat it. They told me they wanted to eat it every day. And I suddenly nodded my head in agreement. A great success. Now I can come to this bakery whenever I want. Hmm, they've got a butter bread available this this month. That looks super delicious. Maybe I'll buy one and eat it fresh at the cafe.
We've seen a surge in customers that are us and travelers. It raised my mood to see how much people care about our brand. Gotta hand it to Oscar for all his hard work. We were recently featured in the Crossroads Times. It was all thanks to his efforts. We've seen a surge in customers that are we see the surge in customers that are also travelers. It brings my mood to see how much people care about him. Okay. 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 His habit of constantly redecorating re the house, redecorating the house, is frustrating. Is it redecorating? Redecorating? I'm able to live a nice, peaceful life thanks to the time I poured into being a politician. I've been blessed with the gift of politicians' pension to retire on. Anyway. The old lady is a bit of a tough nut to crack. The last gift I gave her didn't el didn't el 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 okay. The last gift I the last gift I gave her didn't elicit any sort of response. Her inability to cooperate is frustrating, honestly. Hmm. He needs to apologize for profusely in French. <laughs> Why? The project for constructing the new city hall building is currently frozen. Our politicians are in disagreements over the materials to be used. I really hope they resume construction within this fiscal year. I'm involved with the development of new city hall. I'm feeling nervous over today's diet regarding the building's construction. to be locked. Well, back to work I go. I'm saving up my money to go see, to go, to go and see an Arkansas. Me, I'm saving up my money. I'm saving up my money to go and see Arkansas live again. I gotta put my heart and soul into working, so that so that I can make it a reality. Everything I do is to meet Ilya. I'm working my butt off every every day for this. Now the last house, the last area, this area. Hmm. Maria Bell was featured in some business magazine today. I don't care what kind of magazine it is. I need it now. I'm going to cut. I'm going to cut out her pictures and make a secret. Make a scrapbook out of them. Out of them. But Mar Maria Bell's amazing. When I grow up, I want to be just like her. Hmm. Why can't Rio be like Momo from Tally's place? She's a good kid. She's a smart cookie. She always helps out with her work. I wish that my little Rio would learn a thing or two from her. <sighs> if only Rio would follow her example. Oh, Tio. Yes. What is it? You got a weary look on your face, so I thought you might be exhausted. Hey, hey, Mary, Maria Bell. When I grow up, I will be just like you. Hmm. Is it my imagination, or are you are you okay? I think it's just a bit of fatigue from investigating the moon temple yesterday. I may have strained myself a bit too much. 
Jiuta's always saving us with her perceptive abilities. Yeah, she's helped us. She helped us more times than I can count. I'm trying to push yourself too hard, okay? Yes, I understand. I don't know what happened, but it sounds like she had a rough day. Make sure you, make sure you, make sure you get lots of rest, okay? You ain't banned from straining yourself any further. You're banned from straining yourself any further. Aww. All right, is everybody for this side? Yeah, she's still at the kitchen. Yep. Still at the kitchen. Hmm. Oh, we're talking to this guy, right? Oh, what a wood circle. Oh, wait, actually, we forgot to talk to some people over here. The alley. Back alley feels a little ominous today. I snuck a peek into that alleyway over there, and I was met with the glares of those men in black suits. What's their deal? I should probably quit working for the day. No, I'm going to pull in less sales than my rivals if this keeps up. Hmm, this isn't looking too great. This isn't looking too great. I gotta come up with more ideas. Hmm. Why the heck's why the heck is so quiet today? Probably anybody's passed through. I'm gonna start crying if I don't get any customers soon. Maybe why the heck is so quiet today? Maybe it's just my imagination. Hmm. Mrs. Melda is operating some sort of terminal under the counter. Oh goodness, a newest office? Rated? <laughs> this is quite the series of events. I haven't been this excited in a good long time while. That was information from Jonah, I presume. Oh, who can say? After living in Crossbow for as long as I, as I have, you start to notice incidents like this happen from time to time. Oh, how thri- oh, how thrilling. Now, how exactly will- Chow respond to such an embarrassing slight embarrassing sight. Slight. Isn't that a tad bit reckless to say, ma'am? Yeah. Ravage and Co. is right is right down the street. Aren't you at least a little worried? Hmm, I suppose so. I am worried about real estate prices dropping because of this commotion. <laughs> Alright, I forgot about how crazy she is about the real estate industry. Why haven't the police updated anything in the database yet? I mean, they are dilly dally, or are they truly the incompetence? The incompetence. For crying out loud, won't you start investigating already? Running her mouth off like we we aren't standing in, in front of her. Mm -hmm. Stupid old man, trying to trying to fill me up. Stop trying to fill me up. Stop trying to fill me up. A uh, right on their office? Seriously? That came completely out of left, out of left behind, left of field. Okay, that came, that came completely out of left field. 
give out things then. I sure hope it doesn't explode into an all out war. You guys are waiting on hey you as next move. Man, this is too much anxiety. Anxiety. today. Yeah, they're all a little more pissed off than I imagined. Well, they did just raid Yui. He, they're probably on the edge worrying about a possible retaliation. I sense a great deal of tension and pain radiating throughout, throughout the alley. I would advise against approaching them. Why? Just last night, a black orbital car crashed right into the park in the, in the harbor district. Not only that, but people supposed to, but people supposedly heard the sound of numerous gunshots too. Could have been other than Ravage. It's so obviously them. Damn Ravage. It's one thing after another with them. My grandpa came up to me this morning and told me to keep a close eye on Melly. Well, there was another accident earlier, so I should probably be a little more careful. It's like Grandpa got called over to City Hall. It's not like they wanted him to give some kind of statement. Guess things are hectic there too. Roy said he'd play with me today, so I'm pretty excited. Hooray! I'm going to hang out with my brother forever. Oh. I'm going to play with him so much. I heard the chairman of the business owners association was going to meet with the diet. Good luck to him. He's a representative, so I hope he scores us a large budget. Hmm. The chairman of the Business Owners Association essentially acts as East Street's representative. He's been attempting to gather up help from all the, from all of the merchants around the city. I heard there was some crazy shootout in the Harbor District li last night. Man, problems way scarier than anybody gives it credit for. The Brazil girl's nearby, so I figured we should be safe, but still. Man, problems way scarier than anybody gives it credit for. I was able to recently figure out the optimal shopping route. I made sure to remember the quirks of each and every shop. <laughs> It's always, it always makes me giddy when I manage, when I manage to save some Mira. What? I figured out every shop's quirks, and with it, the optimal shopping route. Phew, it feels like I just managed to solve a difficult calculus problem. I'm so happy I could kiss you. Get away from me. Hey, Ducky, okay, welcome to the stream. Hi there. Are you interested in my goods? Everybody's up in arms over some incident. But we've just been minding our own business. There's no point in worrying about it. So I want to buy some... So want to buy some of my goods? Still, though, Din seems totally un... Din seems totally unfazed by the whole thing. Do you think... Do you think he doesn't worry about rumors? Or is he just totally oblivious?
Doing good, thank you. My little kid? No. Welcome, folks. Thanks for shopping at Din's Fresh. Bins have been booming all day, so I figured, hey, why not put it on? Why not put it all in a little spill? Why not put on a little cell? Come on over and take a quick look. Hmm. Oh, the man in my household. They all came home together yesterday and started immediately nagging me about dinner. I swear, the only time they've, they're ever in range, they're ever in agreement with each other is when they're complaining. Hmm. I did hear that something went down pretty recently. Not my problem though. Not a chance in Gehenna I close up shop over something like that. I know chicken. Crossbed and merchants have crossbed and merchants back in the day used to conduct trades even in the middle even in the middle of wars. I'm a simple little merchant. So nothing short of literal an end of the world is going to make me close up shop. Hmm. Dedication. My husband, my husband is always fussing about what is going on in that in diet. That's why, if any possible times isn't delivered, he gets all rest, he gets all restless and unruly. Of the crossbow times didn't get delivered this morning. As my wife, she might think, but she's just as clueless as I am. Oh no. Has the paper been put on hate height? Hiatus? Hiatus? The latest issue of crossbow times didn't get delivered this morning. Okay. Hiatus? Hmm. Yep. Well, she kind of did. I've been seeing a bunch of black vans whenever I drive on the highway. There are usually there are usually guys wearing shades behind the wheel. They don't seem they don't seem none too friendly. I get the crease whenever I, I get the crease whenever I, I drive past them. And if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure those vans are made from in the Empire. They're pretty expensive too. Was there always a trading company that used those vans? Nah, we did it. Uh oh. I think we're forgetting something important, Buck. Do we need money if we're going to open the store? Crap, you're right. How can you forget something so, so important? What the hell, Rose? Rose? You only just remembered it yourself! Right? Come on in. Need something to eat? You're looking pretty worried there. Something going on? Something going on outside? Speaking of something going on, Puck and Rose look like they might be breaking up. Honestly, might be better for them than wasting their time here every day. Hey, Shan Shan. Puck and Ruth are always so energetic. I used to go to Sunday school with them. I'm a little jealous of their friendship. I've been making this soup ever since I was out in the Republic. Don't ask for the recipe. It's a secret. Alright. Hmm. 
here are and here are the fish skills. You know, ghost salmon are kind of like phantoms. Heard they only swim around the waters in the main area, though. Their their flowing sleek figure and those shining golden scales. The golden salmon truly is the salmon to end all salmon. You know, ghost salmon are kind of like phantoms. Heard they only swim around the waters in the main area, so. Can't sing shit. <laughs> Where's your shift schedule is posted? Ariel standby, Scott standby, Winslow standby, Lynn standby, Aola standby, Estelle standby, Joshua standby. Ariel standby! The SS boys are back again, eh? So you all come. Have you, have you already heard the news? Yeah. I assume that means you're already well aware then. Well, yeah. We contacted everybody in the branch already, so they're so they're gathered on the second floor. Ooh, we've gotta prepare ourselves for the possibility of a war between the two organizations. It's just I feared. Damn, the police are slacking compared to you guys. I don't have much to offer in words, but know that our but know, but know that our procedures are much different from yours. We've got our own way of handling an emergency, as I'm sure you do too. I think you'll be able to handle them if you conduct yourselves in the usual manner. Good to know. Thanks. There's no, there's not a doubt in my mind that Ravage launched in a, that attack on Hiyue's office. The real question is, why did they do something so unexpected in the public eye? But anyway, I want to get a full picture of the situation before we take any action. Chow is an incredibly cunning man. I doubt he'll take this line low, lying down. He probably already has something planned for Ravage. There's not much we can do about it, other than to be as prepared as possible. Hmm. There they are, everybody's here. I'd like you to focus on protecting the injured if an emergency happens, Aeolia. She looks, she looks cute. Why can we? Why is there no art of her? I know. I've got my road locked down tight already. Ideally, I prefer to search for a way to peacefully resolve this. Yeah, likewise. We'll have to prioritize gathering intelligence in order to pull it off. I won't let civilians get caught up in some idiotic spat because of the mafia. We'll have to prioritize gathering intelligence in order to pull it off. Oh, you guys came. You hear about the big news about Hei Hiyue already? Yeah, we've already st we already started conducting our investigation. Actually, I just noticed. Haven't all of the bracers gathered here? Haven't all of the bracers gathered here? I see the divine blade of wind that is downstairs. It is truly a sight to behold. <laughs> yeah. They contacted all of us on our enigmas this morning. And that's why we've all gathered here on, on a such short notice. Damn, you guys are way too coordinated. Are you sure you're not just a bunch of slackers? That's messed up. But anyway, Ravis sure left one heck of a mess for us to clean up. You said it, sis. You said it, sister. Sure. There might be less people there at night, but civilians still could have gotten caught up in their mess. I'm so pissed at the Mafia. I can't wait to rearrange their faces with my staff. Oh, it's those at it again! 
It smells at it again. Everybody beware of a stove staff. I'm so pissed at the Mafia. I can't wait to rearrange their faces with my staff. Hmm. I may be a licensed physician, but I'd be, a but I'd be happier if I had less work to do. After all, it means that, that less people are getting hurt. Don't mess with the stealth. Yep. We should get a full search of the, of the Mafia's compound going for now. With all that connections they have for smuggling heavy weaponry in, into the city, they could start a huge gunfight at any time. Hmm. You've got the divine win of Blade himself, the young heroes of the borough. An expert marksman, a hard-ass refugee from the Empire, a physician, and, the, and last but not least, a specialist in, in the Taito School of Martial Arts. That's me, obviously. Still owns. <laughs> Even though we're totally stacked with high cable bracers, we still need to exercise caution while working here. I recommend you follow suit. I thought I had a solid grasp on the situation in Crossville, but when a situation like this occurs, it feels like there's a huge barrier to, to overcome. They're, at, they're most likely at, back at, um... They're most likely back at, um, the borough, but when a situation like this occurs, they feel like there's a huge barrier to overcome. Fortunately, I think we were able to accurately assist, assess the situation. I thought I had a solid grasp of it. Oh, it's okay. Somebody's mom's taking care of him. Man, I wanted to scope out some details on the Mafia too. Those jerks ferret, ferret us though. There's apparently some kind of agreement that lets the police take precedence in times like this. So on that note, you guys are going to do the snooping for us, right? Right? Hmm. <laughs> this is the city's this is the city's east exit. We already have our hands full with the US case. So let's deal with that first. No! She, she don't even approve it. At all. That big dude with weird haircut kind of scares the hell out of me. I get some I get some bad vibes from their group. I, promise me you'll never go near them. Okay, Ruse? Hmm. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, I got it. I saw a butterfly take flight a moment ago. Spring has really started to settle in, hasn't it? Hmm. Chicken here. My doctor and I had a long discussion when I went to stay at Ursula Medical College yesterday. What a valuable experience that was. Now I'm even more motivated to get accepted there. Yeah, don't, don't they usually publish the newest issue for that business magazine today? I used to subscribe to it a long time ago, but my business has long since folded. I'm a complete shovel, so why bother? Hmm, I think I'll take my first trip out of the out of the department store in a long run. In a store in a long, long time. Hmm, I think I'll take my first trip out of the department store in a long, long time. I was minding my own gosh darn business taking a walk when I had a bit of a run in with the delinquent. I believe that blue haired lad was that new rookie. 
Either way, he had a bit of a dangerous look in his eyes. Scared the heck out of poor me, poor old me. That's it, nothing else. Hmm. Risha, Risha appears to have left the apartment ridiculously early this morning. I think she may have woken up two or three hours before my husband even. Risha's job is difficult, and she manages to get up bright and early every day. Mommy told me that if I can help her with chores, Daddy might come home sooner. I'm going to try. I'm going to try so hard to clean the house. Hmm. Doors firmly shut. A voice can be heard inside. <laughs> ah, that's the stuff. When I die, let me go with a call on in hand. Man, that guy's always drinking. I think I forgot to talk to people in this part. Right here. I wonder how bro's doing at work. Sis, are you alright? You live so close to the harbor district, so I got a little worried. Aww. Yep, everything's fine. Aw, you hurry back home for me? You have your occasional cute moments, Azel. Is that really necessary? I was seriously worried about you, so I don't appreciate the mockery. Azel was worried about that incident that happened last night, so, I came, so he came to check on us. I'm so happy, it could bring a tear to my eye. Hmm. That's it, we have no idea where he is. I heard something horrible happen in the Harbor District recently. Fran isn't a detective, so sh she shouldn't have to investigate crime scenes. But nonetheless, I still worry for her. The CPD has been getting involved in many dangerous incidents lately. So I continue to grow more worried for my daughter. I know it's only natural for you, for you officers to get involved in the front lines. Please try not to worry too much about what people might think of you. some huge kerfuffle over in the harbor district. And speaking of the harbor, all you have to do is go north up the road, outside here to get there, right? That's a little too close for comfort. Okay. Well, we do kinda keep someone somewhere between here and their heart. Who? Oh, you mean Anton? Back to the to the downtown, then we'll go to the other side. Then we'll go to the harbor. About to end the stream soon, guys. Let's see. It's all good, no worries. Let's see. What the heck are we supposed to do about the about those delinquents? I'm feeling kinda anxious. What was all the yelling I've been hearing? I don't know about you, but I'm starting to get a little bit anxious about it. Okay. I managed to meet up with, the, with that gal Wendy yesterday. Been forever since I last saw her. Says she's used to working her job these days. <laughs> Must be nice to still be young. I feel you can probably adapt to anything life throws at throws you pretty easily. There's no way an old coot like myself can simply change the way I'm living. May as well run this factory until I kill her. You can't make anything yet? My god! 
me Adios sake the love of Adios damn it now they've gone and done it if that child guy pulls something crazy there'll be riots in the streets are you trying to scare us with the are you trying to scare us with a dramatization? You kinda know you can keep a straight face while spouting a light like that. Excuse me, ma'am. Are you in possession of any information that may assist us in our investigation? Well, all I can tell you is that Ravager's goons were behind that raid. I'm not an information, bro information break broker, so I don't really give a flying rat's ass about all that stuff. If you want to get some info, go talk to them. Your go talk to them yourselves. Still though, poor Garcia must be having a hard time with these days. He has a lot more gray hairs ever since joining Ravage. You know what? I know that I'm in, I know that I'm in safe hands if we're if we're ever attacked. Mama's already used to that sort of thing. She she beat anybody at their own game. What kind of store is this? You know, Mama ran a store in a conflict zone before I was ever before I was even born. She'd always tell me about these crazy firefights she had with her customers. Hmm. Oh, customers! Please hold on a minute. That leads to the basement storeroom, and you're definitely not allowed in there. So keep your asses right up here if you want to buy something. Did you not hear me the first time, customers? Thought I told you to never set foot near the basement. If you're interested to buy something, do it here. <laughs> oh, Jingo. Jingo, 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 Jingo. <laughs> I can't believe I did that. I never liked him anyway. All he did was boss me around the whole time. Well, not anymore going in? Everybody's totally shot right now. <laughs> Just you wait. By tomorrow, I'll be the greater leader of the Vipers. I'll be the great leader of the Vipers. <laughs> manager. Hello, Jingo. May I speak to your manager? What the hell's the, what the, hell's the matter with Dino? Huh? But it was a one-on-one, -on -one and Walt told us to quit your bitching. Think I could just ignore this? Something happened. Something happened, guys? Yeah, you could say that. Do you know that, idiot? Do you know challenged one of our leaders, Jed, to, to a fight? It was totally insane, too. He kept trading blows until it was decided by an elbow to the jaw. He's just a newbie. He somehow managed to, to take down Jed? It's impossible. I'll never forget that bastard. When did, G when, did Gino when did Gino become so disrespectful? Oh, another one. And how the hell did he take down Jed? That doesn't make sense anymore. Jed's the second strongest out of all of us. He's also one of the group's leaders. Who the hell does G Gino think he is? He'll pay for this. Just one of the more senior dudes in our group. And he usually trains us. How did Dino absolutely destroy him? Something ain't adding up. Okay. Jed, go to the hospital. Now. No, I'm good, boss. The doctor seeing me like this would be an embarrassment to the Vipers. Don't let me repeat myself. Don't let, me don't let me review myself, you dumbass. Get your ass to the hospital, or I'll send you there on a stretcher myself. Sorry. I'll go. <laughs> go, go, go! Unbelievable! It's unbelie unbelievable! Just down for the count! Yeah, yeah! A fight's a fight, and that's fight all! What? 
I don't want your stinking paws around here, you dogs. Watch yourself. Watch yourselves, punks. You're on my turf. I don't like it one bit. Besides, you four have nothing to do with this. Go ahead and scram. No matters, Jingo. Yes. <laughs> she told somebody that's in, that well, uh, somebody in charge of the mafia to shut up. Shut up. No, Wawa. The mafia's dispute has sent a bunch of people to the hospital where my old man works. Sounds like that rumor wasn't a lie. <laughs> pretty gutsy thing to do in the middle of, the, of downtown. Can't say I'm surprised that the police are finally making their move. Those m m mobsters have been wandering around here again. D -d -d -do, us a, d -d do us a favor and arrest them. D -d -d them. You've already helped us out once before. I'll rearrange those m m mobsters' faces if they show up here again. Hazel returned home after he heard about the incident in the Harbor District. His house is pretty close to there. They are. One of the Vipers has been behaving strangely for the last week. What's up, Wazzy? Something wrong? Oh, it's nothing. I'm just a little worried about what the Vipers plan to do. I heard a bit of a minor dispute going on last night. What's with all the commotion in the city? Heh. <laughs> you think everybody's excited for tomorrow's full moon? You think everybody's excited for <laughs> You think everybody's excited for tomorrow's full moon? Alright, that's everybody. Did we do a request last time? I think we did, right? Let me go check. Let's go to the harbor. Everybody's gathered over there. Look at that. Something big happened last night. The police have been freaking out over it all morning. What do we plan to do? Not close my sh not close my shop, that's for sure. I'm not so weak that I turn tail and run from something so insignificant. The path of the noodles waits for no man. If they think that I'm going to close down my stall over something that little, then they've got another thing coming. No, I was gonna close my noodles. 
Oh, Nodo's alive! Those are all the police cars today. Do you think something happened? Hey, I... Hmm? What happened? Oh, gravel fight stopped fishing? Almighty angels. What unsettling predicament. I better send my granddaughter back home today. It killed me to get her caught up in a dangerous situation. Oh, you don't give a fuck about fishing now, motherfucker? Now? I mean, that's good, but still. Screw you, old man. You need to spend time with her at the festival. Like, Grandpa, we're not getting out of the festival. Let's go hang out. Oh, damn it, I'm fishing, dumb little shower. Get down. I like coming to the park to relax and unwind. Yet, yet that somehow gets taken away from me. What the hell are the police good for? Wow, look at all those look at all those holes. Shh, be quiet, stay away. Yo, it might work, hold on. Let's see. Nope. And all right, she, all she wanted to do was hang out. You know, I was about, I was out on a walk, on a walk right here. It got cut short when an angry police officer stopped me, though. Hmm. And you is trading? Never heard of him. Did they do something to anger the mafia? Hope nothing bad happens. heavy weaponry all over. They say didn't resort to blowing them up with explosives. Ah, I see you guys are on the scene too. Hey friends, how's the situation looking? We rushed we rushed out here as soon as we, we heard the news. I don't know much yet. All I've heard is that shots were fired in the middle of the night. Dooley and the others are in the middle of conducting an investigation. So like the first division took the took on the case immediately. Well, they are highly coordinated. We'd like to ask the members of Heya some questions. Do you mind letting us inside? Uh I suppose I could. I was only told to not let civilians pass through here. You have to make up an excuse to, to do it for me though. Of course. Thanks for, thanks for helping us out. Can we talk to people? Okay, cool. The, the occasional dispute isn't particularly rare. But this is the first time we've experienced a company being the victim of a violent attack. The whole situation's been an eye-opener. And you want to know what the police did? Dilly squat. I bet you'd be able to don't detonate a building and they still wouldn't care. Right here. Psst. Ravage is definitely responsible for this mess. This is why I'm so scared of the mafia. Hmm. That Grace already rushed out, looking for her latest scoop. She left. She left to me to cover the rest of the diet session. Guess I'll try my hardest to do a good job. Okay. The Crossbow, the Crossbow Times had to temporarily sus suspend its publication today. We are terribly sorry for the inconvenience. This has brought. Okay. We are terribly sorry for the inconvenience this has brought our loyal readers. Last night was absolutely dreadful. Chris's article isn't respon responsible for this giant mess, is it? Let me see. 
What the fuck was that? Nope. Nope. Don't work. Figures. Took out that took out that fresh coat of paint. It's easy to see just how it's easy to see how dangerous Crossbow really is. By the way, our old office building had a back door, just in case the company was ever attacked. That way, the, that way, in the case of emergency, the paper could still be published. The show must go on, as they say. That was our prime. <laughs> area serves as Crossbow's business district. It's supposed to be one of the safest places in the city. Should we get a back door installed here too? Uh, excuse me, people are hard at work here. Please go to the front of the desk if you have any inquiries, thanks. <laughs> excuse me. I'm sorry, but the editorial department is close to the general public for the time being. Please direct any of your inquiries to me. Oh, really? Excuse us then. They don't want us to go to the second floor. Let's not bother them. I'd rather without looking at it. <laughs> we saw a report about a shooting that took place in the Harbor District. I kind of got the impression that there are some sort of turf war going on in the underworld. We have lots, we have lot, we have lot more guards posted than usual today. There was a fire by the Harbor District last night. It just, it just serves as a reminder that guards like us have to stay sharp. <laughs> Hell? A, temp a temporary suspension of the Crossbow Times? Unbelievable. I am outraged. I look forward to bringing through the column in the economic section in every issue. I don't believe this. I never heard of such thing. Are you trying to insult me? What? <laughs> We've increased the number of guards on duty by about 20%. Just, pre just precautionary measures, considering the shooting that just happened in the Harbor District. Hmm. It's our job as guards to help make our patrons feel safe. There may have been sh a shooting recently, but I assure you, the IBC is perfectly secure. It doesn't seem like there are there are as many customers as usual. Hmm. Must be because of the shooting. So like, we don't have enough manpower to station guards outside the IBC. I heard there were I heard there was some sort of raid. That's never that's never good news. Thankfully, the security department does a flawless job. There's nothing to worry about inside the building. I'm covering the inside of, of the building is secure at the very least. On the other hand, I couldn't tell you if our stock prices are secure. What should we do? It doesn't help that Mr. Croix is away either. Hmm? Are you referring to the incident that took place in the Harbor District? Is everything okay here, Lengfei? Were any of you affected? No, we're all fortunately safe and sound. I'm more worried about our stocks. Their value is volatile, so they may end up being affected. Our board of directors are trying to work out how to handle this. Ms. Kroos has been dis in discussions with the board of directors about how to handle this. I'm hoping this doesn't affect our stock prices. Hmm. Oh god.
yeah. Alright. Let's go basement five. I was asked by the folks, I was asked by the folks that have received to lend a bit of my genius to the project. We're smack dab in the middle of coding a system for the Orbital Network Project's second stage test. They brought the chief out from the Epstein Foundation. The work today must be terribly difficult. Chief Roberts can actually be quite proficient when he keeps his mouth shut and himself busy. Wow. As of now, he is classified as one of the continent's leading minds in the field of global technology. Are his fingers even hitting the keyboard? How is this speed humanly possible? Fucking okay, one sec. I just remember something. Hold on. Give me one shot. Hmm. Shut up, let me see. Four. Whatever. And... Okay, mission accomplished. Alright, let's get back to it. <laughs> Did I humans? Miss Coist is in particularly bad mood today. What's her problem? Since we're hiding down here in the in this basement, it feels like we're secluding ourselves from any current events. Okay. We're grateful for the help Chief. We're, we're grateful for the help Chief Roberts has been providing with us, providing us with. As one of its original developers, Chief Roberts is a specialist when it comes to their orbital network. Oh man, it's a reassuring to have him around. Alright. Now, top four. From here. She's here. Yep. Honestly, those imbeciles. Is there a single brain call amongst any of them? Calm down, Maria Bell. I think you already heard about the situation, right? Well, obviously, it only happened within earshot of here. How dare those barbarians have a firefight this close to IBC headquarters? Curse you, Ravage. They'll be held to pay if this affects stock prices. Is that right? Well, considering the position you're in, I can hardly blame you for being worried. Give me a break. How dare this nuisance occur with, while father is away? I'm utterly dumbfounded by Ravage's thought process. Did you also, I noticed all this. What is all, what is all that in the background? Anyways. Alright, looks like we're done here. Looks like we're done with the um, talking. I'm about to end the streams in a bit. Okay. 
<laughs> who the heck is who looks crazy enough to open fire during the dead of night in a place like this? By the way, make sure you go come up with, a, with an excuse or something to, for Dudley. I don't want to end up with him keeping an eye on me. Hmm. Hello guys, can I talk to you? No? Okay. Hey, you is? You is. Where are you is now? Those clothes? It's all destroyed. What's back there that we can't go in there? Here we go. Chow, my apologies for intruding on you. We wish to collaborate with you, so would you be willing to share details of the race with us? You have, you all have to, you have to forgive me. After all, it was late into the night. I haven't the foggiest idea of whom the assailants, assailants may be, or why they targeted our humble company. Even so, it appears you were able to mount an efficient defense. The first and second floors are devastated, yet this room remains spotless. How in the world were you able to fend off assailants armed with heavy machine guns? That's what? That is true. Can this please teleport or something? I'll admit, it was tricky. However, the assailants managed to escape our grasp, I'm afraid. Many of our men were sent to stay Ursula. Dear, oh dear, what a disaster. You have my condolences. You have my condolences. If you'll... If you'll... Excuse us. It's like, damn it, is that what I think it is? You four? <laughs> yeah, it's us, what? What's the special support section doing here? Why, good morning, Detective Mannings. I see the rest of you are in attendance, too. Pardon our interruptions, child. I know you're busy with the aftermath of the raid, but could I borrow a minute of your time? Anything for you, my friend. Whoa! If you'll excuse us, then, Doodly. I appreciate you having stopped me. Damn! If you'll excuse us, then, Doodly. I appreciate you having stopped by there. We'll step aside then. <laughs> this irritates me to, to no end, but I'm leaving this snake to you. Try to get what you can out of me. Uh, yes, sir. <laughs> Job take, yoink. <laughs> it has been quite some time, my friends. I hear you all had quite the. Uh, I hear you all had quite the adventure on the final day of the anniversary festival, correct? I'm assuming Yin has already informed you. As you know, the special support section doesn't follow conventional investigator protocol. And with that in mind, how about you go ahead and tell us your true intentions? Oh. What's this? There's no point wasting our time with his usual song and dance. Not only that, we have a lot of ground to cover it with Chow. I figured I'd get straight to the point. Oh, damn, Lloyd. Whoa, Lloyd. Pretty gutsy move, eh? I'm surprised, Lloyd. It's rare to see you act audaciously. <laughs> Exactly as, exactly as I had anticipated, Mr. Bannings. I had seen this coming from the beginning. Very well. I am not particularly fond of trivial exchanges anyway. If your questions are within the realm of my knowledge, I will provide the, answer you, the answers you seek. Thank you, child. I wanted to ask you about these three topics. The silent, the silence, true identity. Do you pick one or is both? Is all of them? Is all of them? Is 
inside his identity. So, are you positive Ravage is behind last night's break? Can you say for certain that the attack wasn't carried out by a third party? I highly doubt it was anyone other than Ravage. Doubting the possibility entirely? Doubting the possibility... Doubting the possibility entirely, are we? Sir. The asylums may have been masked to conceal their identities, but there's no doubt it was Ravage's men. Their weapons and combat style were identical to Ravage. That kind of stuff isn't so easy to obscure. I see. That makes sense to me. In that case, something's still rubbing me the wrong way. I hear you and Heiyue students are all pretty damn good martial artists. Your main man Lao here looks like he could hand he could hand out beatings left and right. You flatter me. I'm sure Ravages I'm sure Ravages doesn't have a shortage of combat pros. But none of them could match up with you guys one on one. So then, how did you guys get trashed so hard by a handful of the drug of the thugs? Was that old killing bear leading the charge or something? No, I don't believe he, he participated in the attack. Neither did his right hand men for that matter. We believe Ravage's regular combat personnel to be behind the attack. If that's the case, then how? Though their techniques were simple, were simple, their speed and power were beyond comprehension. They were able to brandish those heavy machine guns single-handedly. Our defenses were easily crushed by their unnatural strength. They overtook the first two floors with ease. No fooling. It wasn't only limited to their power speed either. They had they had inhuman endur endurance as well. As thanks to that, I had to put into practice a few dangerous techniques. The, the, the dangerous techniques? Like what? You seem pretty knowledgeable about combat yourself, Chao. I am nothing but an amateur as compared to Master Yin. Future, future inter interactions. I'll get straight to the point, Chow. How did you plan to respond there, Ray? Oh, oh, what kind of question is that? Take a moment to ponder on what kind of organization a U.S. is. You found your answer, correct? So you're after revenge? Oh, please, keep such scandalous rumors to yourself. I've been merely referring to crisis management. At the end of the day, we only speak, we only seek profits. And in situations where, where our profits are threatened. It is my own sworn duty to crush our antagonizers through the appropriate methods. I fail to see what's so strange about that. Yeah? What an annoyingly shoot man. The requesting assistance from the U.S. main office lie among those proper methods? Uh, uh, he's calling the big guns from Hayu's, Hayu's main office. Awfully blunt, are we? My pride is at stake here. I have no such plans at this moment. Furthermore, there is no guarantee the main office will, will respect with my wishes. They may intervene regardless. Well, I should be able to stave off direct intervention for a little while at least. Either way, we lack the proper knowledge of Ravage's current state, so we don't have ineffective countermeasures for them. We're simply investigating their mo movements for the time being. So our most reliable and cooperative employee, in fact. You request against, assist you request against assistance? The best of the best for these kind of undercover missions, yeah? Okay, <laughs> he's like, Kia's identity. This, is, this isn't directly related to the case in question, but I figured I'd ask why I'm already here. Do you really know anything about Kia? Do you really not know anything about Kia? Uh, are you sure, Lloyd? Hmm, Kia, you said. 
Is that a person's name? Or perhaps some kind of code? Forgive me for speaking out of line. You're more serious than I expected. All I know is that Kia is the name of that little girl you took into custody after the Swartz auction. Well, in that our dear collaborator offered you a small piece of advice there. The exhibits for the second half of the auction are all stored in the room over there. According to information that was sent to the AUS, there's a bond. There's a bond, so to speak, among those items. <laughs> I recommend you confirm it for yourselves. A large leather trunk will be exhibited in the second half of the auction. Inside the trunk is a bomb, which will only serve to jeopardize Ravager's position. We were able to receive that piece of information via our own networks. We've had no means of descending who's this information was. As of yet, however, in s as of yet, however, in some ways that only made it more credible. We wanted to be certain, so we asked for our dear master Yin to go check on it. Even in my wildest dreams, I never expected the true identity of the bomb to appear in the form of in the form it did. Yeah. Looks like he's gonna feign ignorance until the very end. Let's assume you're telling the truth. Do you have, do you have an inkling as to who that inf informant might have been? Logically speaking, a bombshell of this magnitude points to the actions of a ravaged defector. However, taking into account the skills required to convey the information to us, they must be adapted. At any rate, this is as far as our knowledge regarding chaos goes. I appreciate it, if you believe me. Understood. Thanks for answering us honestly. No further questions. Now then, does this conclude your questioning? Yes, for the moment. I appreciate your cooperation. Do you mind if I give do, do you mind if I give the department an outline of what we discussed? Do as you like, my friend. By the way, by the way, check up Fannings. What's up? I'll be honest with you. This raid was far beyond what I thought Ravage was capable of. I was under the impression that I was fully cognizant, cognizant of Ravage's strength, connections, and patterns. Yet, they were able to pull off such a brazen attack on us in their weakened state. They splendidly surpassed all my expectations. I must say, I am unbelievably excited for what's to come. I cannot recall a moment in the last few years where a situation didn't proceed in the way I had planned. I can finally wield my intellect to crush my foes without remorse. This truly is an indescribable joy. Dude, chill out! You were... Unbelievable. Do not think of... Do not think for one second that I will allow the police to ruin my fun. Although, you're special, so I'll grant you a unique opportunity, so to speak. Will you be able to to broker a resolution between both groups before you he, he, begins his all-out retaliation? I'll be eagerly awaiting your next move. Whoa! What the fuck's happening? It's like a war breaking out. That was something. They gave us plenty of useful information to work with, but... I cannot believe they suggested the high possibility of full-blown conflict. If things keep heating up the way they have, then it's about to get real messy. We're screwed if they decide to have a firefight in the middle of town. Additionally, we have to consider the possibility that Hiyue's may call for reinforcements. There's 
all sounding a bit too ominous. It sounds like we have a bit of, of time still, judging what Chow said. Anyway, we can't leave Ravage unchecked any longer. We need to start looking into it before Yayue mobilizes their forces. I agree. Shall we visit each of the districts and question the citizens? No, we don't have time. We don't have enough time. I think it's time to. I think it's time we go straight to the source. Let's go get our. Let's go get our answers from Ravage directly. You're kidding, right? We may have gone there once before, but still. That was before the incident at the auction. Are we not acting too recklessly? Yeah, I can't imagine they overlook anything else outside of Chaos Case. There's something else I'm concerned about, though. What might that be? Garcia's movements. We've crawled with him before, but he never seemed the type to be reckless. I was under the impression that he had a strong command over his subordinates. Do it I. He used to be a well-known Jaeger commander, in fact. Didn't think he ordered his men to launch an assault on the U.S. like that. But as a chance he ordered the attack on the U.S. It's entirely, it's entirely possible that his subordinates acted independently. I'd certainly like to get to the bottom of this. I agree. It'd be a good idea to search for clues around their base. Do you guys want to hit? Do you guys want to head there now? We don't have a choice, do we? As long as we remain outside the, perim the perimeter, the level, of risk the level of risk will be low. Let's go have ourselves a little stakeout. Let's see. Oh, this ain't the same thing. Alright guys, I'm an idiot, I went long, I went the longer route. Alright guys, we're gonna um, stop here. That's it. We did longer than yesterday's stream. But yeah, this is good. Ooh, it's already getting late, so I don't want you guys... I don't want some people to die over. Both kill over. But anyways, guys. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. Wow. A lot went down today. Thank you. Well, what is going to happen? What is going to happen? Looks like he was um, thinking of attacking. I mean, I mean, countering them, doing a retaliation. So that means it can lead up to a big war for the mafias group, for both mafia groups, and they can put a lot of people in danger in Crossbell. Thank you. But yeah. How is this all gonna? I feel like this part, this is probably not I me, mean, not the end of the game, but I feel like the mafia is gonna be the end of this story of the game. Cause that's all it's about the whole through the whole game. Ma mafia, mafia, but this and that. Shady got remain corrupt, and this and that. Blah 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 blah. Ah, fuck. But yeah. No Wawa today. Sorry. Even if we did, even if we did do a quest today, there'll be a chance there'll be no Wawa because that's the only quest we have left. We only have one quest left. But yeah, um, hold on. Let's check. We go, can we go anywhere else? Hold on. Yeah, I'm just at the four. Can we go anywhere else or no? This, this is in order. We already have our hands full with my. Never mind. They don't, they're not letting us go anywhere at all. So this, this means this seems like this something bit's about to happen. We can't go anywhere. Just 
just standing there. Hold on. Hmm, the back alley feels a little ominous today. I snuck a peek into the alleyway over there, but I was a bit. Okay, never mind. She's just there. But yeah, um. That's gonna be it, guys. So again, thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the stream. It was fun. I can't wait to find out more on Monday. Because, yep. That's it for trails this weekend. Tomorrow's gonna be. Another game, another top, I mean, another um game. That's my number one top favorite game series. Zero Chronicles Two, on Nintendo Switch. So stay tuned for that tomorrow. But if you want to hear, but if you want to hear for Charles, that's cool too. Charles is gonna be on Monday, letting y'all know. So until next time, for more The Ninja Heroes, Charles from Zero. That the shutting off. Alright, boys and gents. My back at least was a little ominous today. <laughs> alright, my alright, my just alright, my just and gents. Good morning, good afternoon, good night, all that good stuff. May Goddess Adios protect us all. And guys, guess what? Remember, I told you about my aunt getting coronavirus. Well, 26 days at the hospital. She's back. And she's fully recovered. They said that she was she she she, had, she was there was um, multiple times that she was dying at at her hospital bed, but she kept pushing through. So she's back home. Let's just hope now she she she's careful now. Hopefully one day I can see them again. Someday when things start to cool down. So yeah, so she's crazy how she survived too, cause she's really old. I mean, she's already, at, she's already at the, I mean, she's already um, she's already like in uh, her, in her age where they start to get old, and she's better now. So hopefully everybody else that's out there going through it. I hope they fight, but I hope they fight through it as well. Even the people I don't like, or people I like and I don't like, I don't like. They, they don't deserve this. People that like, come back, man. I mean, they better get, they better push through, so that way we can start hang, talking again and socialize again. And people that I don't like, man, you fucker, better get through, so I can talk shit to you again. <laughs> but yeah, but I hope you guys are staying safe, right? Have an awesome, safe final day weekend. They say in most cases older people, I mean, it's, they're more vulnerable to it, but she's a fighter. That's good. That's really good that, she, that person recovered, Ariana. Looks like things start to look up a little now for some for people. Rest in peace to those. We lost 400, in, I don't know anywhere other countries, but over here we lost 400,000 people last year. So, rest in peace to them. So, guys, have a safe, awesome, I mean, last day weekend. Okay, remember, almost, always remember, love and keep on gaming. All right, guys, bye bye. Peace. Well, that.